4 of Hex out of his coaster <laughs> and Dungeons and Dragons 5e, the Ravenloft, ancient old games from the dark and distant <laughs> past, shinied up for your audio pleasures. Welcome again. Hello, hey, internet. Me. Hey! I do love it when I fade in and there's just like random shit under the fade when I taste m- m- mess with the audio. <laughs> <laughs> I did release the third one, so we're technically up to date, which is better than basically any other game I'm currently running on the site. Yeah. Which I think is amazing. Hey, we're number one. <laughs> right. Well, you are, because I'm keeping up to date. I'm trying to catch up with Iron Gods because of all the moving house and stuff. It's been mm. a bit difficult to kind of stay on top of all the releases and the audio editing. But um, I'm trying, and there's a bunch of stuff that I've got from my contributor groups that are just sitting there waiting for me to release it. So Cool. Got a bunch. You know, there's the um, Kingmaker, which is like a hundred, episode 106 now. You guys have got a awesome. long way to go. 106. Mm-hmm. That's a long way. Oh, you remember, you get to you get to episode 100. Everybody knows that's the naked episode. <laughs> Always. <laughs> it was fine when we didn't do camera. It was absolutely <laughs> fine when we weren't on camera. But now, it, you know, what can I say? Yeah. <laughs> I used, to have a, I used to have a contributor group called the Pantsless Gamers, which is <laughs> kind of funny. You can listen to their wondrous audio on the site. So thing did account. We now have over 3,000 audio files on the site. And if you started oh, wow. listening now, you would finish listening in two years' time. Damn. <laughs> Stupid, right? Waste of my... No, no. I mean, I don't know how many of them are just me, but there's lots of me talking, and I could have been doing other things like bettering myself. You know? <laughs> Getting a degree, getting promoted, working hard. No, I just sit here and pretend I'm a halfling or something. Is that, bunny is that a rabbit right there? Yeah, a rabbit can. Yeah, rabbit 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 can. can. Yeah. Why have people moved? Who's moved? Who's moved? Everybody's moved. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, the yeah, everybody's. Let me just fix that real. No, don't do that. Let me fix that real. Right, this is incredibly professional. Is fixing your overlay while <laughs> recording. It's not going to break nothing, right? Nothing's going to break. It's probably nah, not, totally. not right either. Hang on, just just quietly moving people around. Don't mind me. Let's see. Oh, good God. I hate OBS <laughs> so bad. I hate OBS so hard sometimes. You think you're right, and then you click go, and you're like, it's all broken. There, everybody's good, <laughs> right? Everybody's in the right box. And I need to fix this overlay and put your character names on it. It's really terrible. Not the worst and slackest DM of a job and everything else is moving. Oh, you cannot out slack me. <sighs> that is true. I maybe am. you should maybe you should adjust my overlay. You've got skills. I no. know you've got skills. I mean it would never happen. Like I would oh. I would slack her and it would just it would just still be undone. Just be super slack. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to learn how to do it. Good. Nice. Good. Good. I accept all help with our <laughs> all, all help is, is good help in my mind. I need the instructions. Oh, oh. That's what Google's for though, right? Totally. Hello. Sorry, Hello. I was I was firing Craig off to see if he would record us because he failed last time, <laughs> um, which is pretty terrible if you think about it, because he's supposed to record us so I can keep the recording safe when I have a secondary recording in case everything explodes. But last time he decided halfway through to just be like, fuck yo! <laughs> run no. off and do <laughs> oh, Guys, my, my roommate is here now. He's- oh, awesome. Hello, on, on roommate. On that chat, you mean? <laughs> on that there chat? I saw. You are definitely not. Your, your audio is not clear. The, on the. <laughs> I feel like your audio is bad today. I feel like I need to send you a new microphone. <laughs> I feel like that one is old and it needs replacing. It's actually new, that's what's sad. Really? Was it less than ten dollars? Is that better? You can still use the headset, just tear that boom off there. No, you know you're completely silent. I think you dropped out of Discord. Yeah, I did for a second. Is that better? Yeah. Better. We are back. Uh, hey, audio issues. I mean what's a game without audio issues, right? What is a game without audio issues? 
It wouldn't be one of our games. That's what it wouldn't be. Oh, it's fucking hot. Getting naked. I'm getting ready for the hundredth episode. Oh, I'm going. Go on. All right. Does anyone know what actually happened last session? We actually killed some shit, finally. You did. You killed some stuff. So as I wrote, uh, as I was being studious and, and amazing as a DM and looking over the things that you'd done and preparing for three hours before the session and making sure I had notes and stuff. Totally. Uh-huh. Yeah, right? Because that's what happens. Um, <laughs> I, I wrote a thing that was very short about what you did. So you began investigating disappearances and um, sudden deaths in the town. You questioned a bunch of people about that. You questioned the constable about that. And then you decided, let's go out to that plantation and see if we can um, figure out whether the people in charge here, um, the Tarascons, actually know anything about what's going on. Also, you have Luke following you, and he's actually a brother of one of these guys who's supposed to run this town. And you figured that you might want to, you know, see if they you could take him home. And... Um, didn't actually go beyond the gate. He actually ended up returning to town because he seemed to be terrified. So, I believe. And then we that. couldn't find our way in or well, something, right? Well, no, you, yeah, the doors were locked for both okay. the servants' quarters. Thank you. Um, I have food now so you can hear me eat. Um, okay. Yes. You, the doors were locked, but you uh, heard movement inside, and then creatures burst out of the front windows and attacked you. And they were dead-looking creatures with lots of tongues. And I don't know whether anyone actually roll, rolled in <laughs> to um, actually identify what they were. Did you actually identify what they were? Did anybody roll a religion check? Everybody. We have a drink. No. Yeah, we Looks do like have an everyone drinks. Everyone drinks. Oh, oh yes, we do. Sorry. There we go. Let's go. Four. Chin chin. Ten. Wine, but it's in like a beer mug going on. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> nope. The rabbit, the rabbit has disappeared. Yeah, everyone's video disappeared for me. Oh, no. try, try going onto the right side bar, scrolling to the bottom, and hitting refresh. Reconnect. Reconnect. There you are. You're back. Come here, little bunny. Back for me. It's, it's the problem running two feeds out of the same internet feed. I've had that problem before. Yeah. It's, it's Plus, it's, importing them all twice. Yeah, basically, you're, you're, yes, yes, yes. You should have two computers and one monitor to share. That would help, right? <laughs> right. And that's the way to go, I think. So, uh, any disagreement on where we are, or I think that's about where we are? No, that's correct. Mm -hmm. I think we cut just as you kind of finished the combat, and you were kind of searching them, and we found that they were dressed in what you would consider to be servant's attire. There was like a maid just... and two guys in kind of servant type <laughs> I shouldn't be playing like in-town music, should I? I should be playing out-of-town music. Spooky, we just killed some dead things music. Always the butler. Always the butler. The butler did it, and all his friends. Hello, Thranduil. How's it going, Bill? Now you're in trouble. Bill's here. Except, uh, for Bill, except for Bill knows what happens when he makes all these players drink, is that they join the game tomorrow and make him really, really drink. <laughs> <laughs> Which I think is hilarious. It's very funny. <laughs> To it's all a lot of fun. our newcomers, I'd like to introduce you to Kevin. Kevin, oh yes, look, Kevin, he's still there. And you're trying to... Uh... <laughs> no, no, don't do that. You're trying to um, animal control him. No, animal companionize him. Make him your friend. That's maybe a little too Sounds like someone's dying. We're hoping he eventually becomes like the leader of the group. <laughs> he's he's probably one of the most sensible choices for group leader, I think. <laughs> Look at those hit points. That's just hey. that's beefy. Come on. I mean, he, he is, and we can swallow small people. Yeah. He is, is he the beefiest? <laughs> Me too. Actually, the most hit points in the party, which is quite amazing. So exactly. one of them was paralyzed, I believe. It was really? It was fun. 
Unless you're a So, after the fight is over, you're still paralyzed for quite a while. Oh, no. It's like minutes, I think, you're paralyzed for. This me here. It's been so long. Well, is that where you were? Is this me here? I know. That, that's uh, probably yes. you. Yes. That's okay. why you got the do not sign on you. Yeah, that's right. You look at the do paralyzed not move. sign. Do not move. Be paralyzed. <laughs> um, oh, because we all know you're paralyzed with a stupid face. Okay. Oh yeah, there's a toy chattering around, right? Mm -hmm. uh, what? They, were, they were not a distracted. They, yeah, he's a tinker gnome, so he makes like little toys. Mm. Oh, he he releases toys to go and distract. Yeah, them. yeah. It's oh, like, okay. He can make little toys like clockwork stuff. It's part Cute. of being a gnome. Right, he's part of the yeah. little red <laughs> hat. <laughs> so you're going to the broken window. So the window on the left there and the window on the right there are both broken. Okay. Like shattered as the creatures burst out. Okay. I'm going to go over by the one you're that um, in... my fellow gnome, the gnome is at. Hmm? <laughs> you want to make me perception checks? Sure. Oh, this is me. I feel like a dice roll around the chat screen because it's nice seeing your big faces, but <laughs> it's also nice seeing the dice roller. But I don't know how to do that. <laughs> there's not a lot of screen real estate. <laughs> why I need a design professional. Uh, what have we got? Karu on a 16, currently leading the pack. I don't know if mine's going to count for the anything. The pack can't see it. a lot. The pack yeah. is really mostly mesmerized by... Uh, yeah, you guys are all two idiots. 16s from Karu and Tomas, and the rest of you are just not, not so it's, interested it's in the them. Cleric, blind. It's the cleric and the spellcasters. Yeah, yeah, the so only two have, that have like, any kind of intelligence anyway. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking about my own toy. <laughs> I mean, that is making a noise, right? Okay, inside the house, you don't really hear anything else. It seems quiet. Eerily quiet. Hmm. I, I think... Remember my spells. <laughs> I think we should sneak through the house quietly and try and see if anyone is else might be here. They might need saving. You heading into the house? <laughs> Yeah. Into the house. Into this, the crying house. Not a great house. It's crying a lot. I don't want it to be crying. Yeah. Let me turn, <laughs> Let me turn down the crying on this dad house. Increase the squeaking. Can you do the same at my house, please? Can you turn the crying down? I can. I can. Well, I'll come around and turn down the crying at your house. Thank you. Right? Thank you. I mean, I can. Oh, man. <laughs> It's gone funny. to new levels. <laughs> I have been upgraded. It's <laughs> pretty funny. Turn the crane down. Turning down the crane. Wait. Yeah, I want to. Yeah, I'd like to have. Uh... Oh, drink, everybody. <laughs> through the house. Uh, there's going know. to be tears for beers, I think. <laughs> Chat says uh... it's a witch. It's a, okay. that's it's a witch. witch. Um, okay, so you process into the house and start to look around. It is a very well-appointed place. Lots of money has been spent here over the years, but recently it appears to be warm. At one point, this house would have been fantastic and fabulous. Fabulous. Mm. A little drab. Does it look lived in? Yes, to some degree, but looking around, it also looks somewhat ransacked. Mm. That's why I'm thinking they're not, they're probably not here. Subscribed uh, for a month. All right. Okay. I've got five more days left. Oh, yay. <laughs> For mine oh. expires. There you go. Things giving out, things giving out unicorn emojis at the moment. <laughs> fancy, fancy. I already have that one. That's I like that you're collecting the emojis. 
My dragon. Okay. Dragon emoji. <laughs> so, uh, you walk around the house. It is. It doesn't look like it's been um, lived in. Well, cared for. It looks like somebody's been here. There's like dirt and filth and rot mm. everywhere. F smell. I see you, Jack. Eat rotten smell coming from one of the back rooms. Home. <laughs> uh, I am paralyzed yet. Yes, you are. You are I would like to go towards the back room, but I'd like to keep my perception kind of keen, be looking around for any traps or signs of, I don't know, danger in general. You know, like one of those signs that just says, danger ahead. Danger. Yeah. <laughs> well, like crying, sound, sounds of crying. Turn them down. Hear little girls giggling. That's always a bad sign. Other people, it's all good. Hello, Leo. Are you in for in for the wine again? Good. I'll start in a moment. Drinking all that. Literally had none of that. You're three quarters step off. <laughs> I've got, I've got to pace myself. Things in the chat. He might make me drink a lot. Get him, thing. Get him. No <laughs> mercy. That's so cute. <laughs> All right, I'm here for you. I'll just drink it all before you can. That's good. That's yeah. great. Yeah, it's good. It's good. I can cash in a, an everybody drink so I can use my sign. Nice. Right. Okay. So you walk into the room. It is. Candles are still lit, even though it's daytime. Mm, they've been burning for a long time. They're those huge pillar candles, and they've run down across the chandelier, uh, chandelier onto the um, table. Mm. In the middle of the table are a number of large covered serving trays and places set for four. This doesn't look good, you guys. Doesn't smell good either. <laughs> Where's the smell coming from? As a small person with limited sure. hit points, I would suggest that the big people the open the <laughs> open the trays. Yeah, I think we should peep inside those. Do you like me to do it with mage hand so we're not actually touching it? Hey, hey. I like it. Endemic friendly. A super cautious group right here. Yeah, so we'll go ahead and do, I'll go ahead and, you know, open one with Mage Hand. Yeah. I mean, they're very, they're various sizes. They're, the, they're those big silver cloches that you put over food to deliver right. it to the table. Yeah. Or we can hey, explore good. the kitchen. I don't know. This is definitely the dining room. There's a treasure. I see. All these, but there's a lot of stuff in here that would be considered worth something like there's a lot of uh, things in this house that would be valuable i mean even the chandeliers candelabras even these cloches are worth money the oh silver God. silver there's uh, silverware candelabra. Here. candelabra i mean i, I do love the away. idea of stealing everything in here and selling it all for gold <laughs> But I'm also, yeah, I'm just, I, I, we'd have to, one, sell it to the people that know where it's coming from. So that that's just not going to work out. <laughs> they they people? People? And I Do think they, we, they we might, we might lose whatever cooperation we might need from the group if we steal from them. But I think we should note it. And before we leave this area, come I back spell. and take their silver. <laughs> We find a new place to sell. Hell yeah! Some somewhere else where they don't know where it came from. Are <laughs> we made something close? Yeah. Yes. Okay. You pick a random one. You want the biggest one, the smallest one. Bunny's choice. <laughs> Karu. That's Karu lives. The biggest one. Uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> biggest one. Why not? Okay. You cast your spell and reach out with your invisible hand and grasp Ooh. the top of the cloche handle and lift it into the air. Everyone else just sees the cloche rising off the table. It is invisible, right, mate? I think mage hand is invisible. 
Uh, you're floating, a spectral floating hand. Oh, it's spectral. Okay, a ghostly so it's like hand. A ghostly <laughs> hand. A ghostly hand appears. It looks. You've cast this spell a few times in the past when you were learning to be a great sorceress, and it's never quite looked like this. The hand looks skeletal almost as it grabs around the hand, uh, the top of the cloche, and lifts. Um, underneath the cloche is a horrifying sight. You see. The remains of a person cooked little, but mostly raw. Yeah. Oh, but no. do the remains like do they seem to be decaying? Is that like accounting for the smell? A, a little, but the whole place now the tops come off. The smell is coming from here. There is definitely mm. these are decayed bodies, but oh. some of some of this is flesh. So fresh. <laughs> so do we have like? Oh, hang on, Zombies everybody drink. Thank that you. Are... Hey, cheers. cheers. Do we have like aware zombies or something? I think yeah, yeah. like because like like vampires can create vampirish. Oh, that's true. And... Yeah. If anyone wants to take a knowledge religion check, I'll let you have another go on what those things were. Mm. I can do that. I, mean, I, knew. I, say, I would hope that would be a cleric who's very religious. Yeah. <laughs> She rolled for one here. last time, wasn't it? Oh no, no, Tom, or, uh, Tomas only has one point in it. <laughs> I only have one point, yeah. But Wait, we'll what try. kind of knowledge roll do you want? Do you want like an intelligence roll? Legend. 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 Oh, okay. I don't do Way that. to go, I'm, Tomas. I'm book smart. I'm not religious smart. Oh. Ew. Ew. <laughs> 20. That is a 20. Uh, nice. Ah, inspiration strikes. Those things outside um, weren't zombies. Zombies don't have tongues like that. They don't have claws mm -hmm. like that. Zombies don't paralyze you. Those were ghouls. Yeah. Ghouls. Which are a product of vampires, if the lore right? stands. So is that, 20. Is that, is that too bad? Huh? <laughs> 20, you know that's not actually true. Ghouls are produced oh, okay. from a human is forced to consume dead flesh over an extended period of time. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, we should burn this. Them, ah, have to do it. They, they, they might end up, they can be formed if they're starving and eat each other and all of that stuff. So you know, it could be a result of cannibalism. cannibalism. It could be, or it could be a result of just somebody making ghouls by forcing people to eat flesh. Right. There's other ways to make ghouls too. Can summon them specifically and all of that stuff with spells. I'm just wondering how much flesh you need. Like, can you like bake it into like a like a pot pie? Oh, are we totally like, sweet potting little... over here? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. This explains a lot. Mm -hmm. Somebody thought ghoul servants will be cheaper to feed. Somebody just make a ghoul friend joke. <laughs> it may have been me. You should be. You should be ashamed. <laughs> <laughs> Terrible. Where's my Komodo although, dragon emote? Although I believe I called session three ghouls out for summer. Just you did. <laughs> <laughs> That's terrible. I still like the first one's name of Unladen Swallows. Unladen Swallow. I like that one too. Okay. It starts with fun and then Wendigo superpowers. He's right. If you eat enough dead people through cannibalism, you might end up as a Wendigo instead. Fun. Get to choose. Well, no, I think the point is you don't get to choose. <laughs> the way you end up as a cannibal, so that's a bonus, right? Hey. <laughs> okay. The house, other than that, seems relatively empty. There's a kitchen, there's dining, there's a study. It looks like it has not been lived in for some time. Mm -hmm. While we're from ground, I'm just going to second wind. Just to is there any cellar or anything else? No, but there is an outbuilding here, which the servants, well, you've assumed were the servants' quarters. Nice. So it doesn't appear as if there's, quote unquote, some master that was with the ghouls. Doesn't look that way. Looks like that may not be the case. But um, who knows? I mean, is there any sort of like restraints? 
nothing like, you can see. I mean, it looks like a normal house that's just been lived in by terrible cannibalistic Plus two. What are we doing? So eight. Eight, I think, Alec. Oh, second wind. He, he did oh, it, yeah, second, yeah, for your fighter level. Yep. A level two. That second wind. And then that both. means you're only two points down, right? No, I'm back to max. Max, oh, okay, cool. Just in case something jumps at me, I want to be ready. No, yes. totally. Just take a break. Our druid took a bit of a drubbing. Yeah. 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 I shall protect you. From this bear. And I attack the stuffed bear. Yeah, the stuff. Attack the stuffed bear. <laughs> 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 oh, you're whacking on the stuffed bear, so to speak. Mm -hmm. I hope not. This is a family uh, show. No, no, it isn't. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Never make that assumption because it's really. So you start humping said bear. <laughs> it's gotta be it's here forcing bear. the ghoul process, though, right? So, hmm, how would we? find them, you guys. Well, we haven't gone and checked out the, uh, what I'm guessing is like a gazebo or... Oh yeah, that side building? Some yeah, sort of something. Like there. And there's like also a, a well that I know this isn't what's coming out of it, but it kind of looks like a hand giving the finger. What? Where are you? Which, uh, the well. Oh, the well. like a hand giving the finger. There is a hand in the well, who knows? The hand in the well giving you all the finger. So you search the house. There are definitely I few people you know. <laughs> should be robbing this house, which might not necessarily be what you want to do quite yet. And you could put it in convenient sacks you could run by later as you leave. <laughs> I'm just Can't making a mental map. Mental map of where all the silver is in the house. Right. It's not a gazebo. A gazebo is just like an open-walled, roofed structure. This is actually a proper building. You assume it's a servant's quarters. Oh. Oh. It's little. Oh, you're talking about the one on the map. Ignore the map. This is a map. The map's uh, that not is, real. That is, it's a map. that is an actual, uh, like, little place where there, where there once wants vegetables and various flowers growing. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. It's overrun and terribly, terribly untended. There is also an outbuilding here that is not on this map that um, you explored before and found was locked before you came over here and decided to take a look at what was here. Mm -hmm. Should we go back to the locked building? Are there windows on that building? There are windows. You decided not to smash anything because you thought maybe the people in the main building might be angry at us smashing things. Well, they're no longer angry. <laughs> they may still be angry. I mean, I don't know where ghouls go when you murder them, but definitely worth a, definitely worth a shot. Should we burn their bodies? Are you actually going to burn them? Are you burning them? Should we? So, yeah. I think we should destroy this flesh in some way, for sure. Usually, usually it's a good idea for undead things to, you know, burn the bodies. Let it burn, let it Make, burn. Making a pile and setting the ghouls alight? What about the stuff inside? The blood-stained tablecloths, the pieces of body in the cloche? Maybe those, the, the meal that was prepared. Yeah, the dead bodies that could be, could be so, the ghoul fuel. Yeah, give me an insight check. Inside. <laughs> Yeah. I'm guessing by that laugh that that was a one. Or well, maybe a negative number. <laughs> it ain't good. Can you actually get negative number? Oh, yeah, I guess you could. <laughs> if you were really, really shitty in your attribute, it's about possible. <laughs> Just assuming they're evil because they're undead. Question mark. Again, Fury, most insightful. It's just, yeah, most yeah. insightful. <laughs> no. You understand, you realize as you're thinking about burning the remains under the cloche that this is dead, but not long dead. And you also realize that people have been being attacked and vanishing from town. Oh. Well, 
do love the insight check in D&D. If this was Cthulhu, you'd have been burning that, and that would have been clues out the window, and I'd have been laughing my ass off as you didn't know where to go. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> I guess D and D is a little nicer. Kinda, it's a little kinda. Just, just a little bit. Um, so, so this, this could, could be. We're just a falling down. They are, they are disappearing. Right? I mean, I guess there's no way to identify them unless we have dental records. <laughs> Something tells me we don't exactly have that in this time frame. And there's a lot of there's a lot of the meat still on the body, but it's been carved apart. So. Right, so I, mean, I assume if it's... you can find a head under one of these cloches, maybe you could do it. Right, so maybe we burn the actual unidentifiable parts, the unidentifiable, right, and then save the heads just to take back to the um, chair. Right. It's a beautiful idea. Save the heads of the missing people <laughs> just in case. Anyway, well, so we can report them and be like, look, we found this house. Pillowcase and carry them over your shoulder. Yeah, <laughs> like I'm glad I'm so small. Like really, I don't have to carry these. So honestly, I'm chaotic neutral, so I could probably care less. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we totally just found these guys. Just I'm found them as is. I think I'd be more along the lines of just burn it regardless of whether it's a head or identifiable pieces. I think it gives some people some peace, so I think it might bring some villagers on our side, get some more cooperation. Mm -hmm. we... They might think we did it, or we were involved. There is that. Nah, there. we showed up in the middle of a crisis. We're just here to help. That's I'm fine. here to help. Steal your stuff. <laughs> I mean, the crisis was already going on when you wandered out of the swamp. So yeah, true. It probably won't blame you immediately. Immediately is the key word there. And we've all seen those. And if they do, right? we just kill them, right? Yes. Yeah, we just yes, murder Hobo <laughs> our way out. We just murder <laughs> our way out. Yes. Yeah. This just turns into murder party 2.0 and we're fine. <laughs> Ain't no ball like, like a murder party. <laughs> the bunny's yeah. I hope the not. Cute. I don't want to go to the murder party. Don't listen to chat. They're going to make you paranoid. Oh, no. I don't trust chat. Mm -hmm. oh, no, you should never <laughs> trust chat. <laughs> you should never trust <laughs> <with> chat. Particularly <laughs> thing, you should never trust him. I love Sting's suggestion of identifying family and culture by taste. <laughs> <laughs> So are we burning the heads or not burning the heads? No. I say we take the heads. Alright, yeah. we'll take the heads burning the rest. Burning the rest. Burning the rest. Including the ghouls. Why are we keeping the heads? Are we really gonna bring them up to some widow and be like, oh, yeah, yeah, really? yeah, of course. Everybody drinks twice. Oh shit. Oh no. Oh. 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 Okay. Hazza. There is only one head. On it. it is female. Hub is heavy. Cool. So it begins. And I feel even better. Could it's a female head. A woman. A sack or a bag or something you find lying around the house. We find one of the trays and we put the head on it on a serving tray. Oh we God! It back. I mean, it's already on, it's already on a serving tray with a little dome over the top. Let's just take that. Yes. So it, I, I don't want sure it. Place to put it right? I mean, you should totally do that. I'm sure the their mum would be very happy to have their daughter back um, on a nice presentation. Flatter. Yeah. Totally agree. <laughs> Totally. Question. Question. You went to so this much trouble, it would be wrong. rude not to, um, <laughs> would be incredibly rude of the, her not to um, you take you in good faith and um, think it was a great idea of yours to stick her dead dog's head on a platter. There <laughs> were <laughs> four places set at the table, is that right? Well, should, we, should we put it in a box and then many, do the end of the scene? did we find? What? Three? How many ghouls had we fought? You fight three. I think it was three. Yeah. That's three, three or four. So, so who's, late, who's late, late to dinner? Right. Who's late to dinner? <laughs> Who is late to dinner? 
Uh, Servants' quarters. I think we'd like to go. Okay. Look at those. We should go look at that. Be right back. Cross across the ground and approach the servants' quarters. You've been here before. It is a low building, single story, has some windows. You know the door is locked. We're going to break the windows. Okay. You break a window near the door that's large enough for you to climb through. And it's dark inside, relatively. There are no candles burning or anything. Although it is daylight, light is streaming in through some of the windows, but it is not bright in there. It's gloomy in there. We can't see anything. You can see some things. I mean, okay. it's, it, it looks like the place has been completely trashed. All of the furniture is broken. Everything is just destroyed. Ooh, I can see it. Yeah. <laughs> Coming at you with that 23. That's 23. Perceptions. Okay, you climb in and search the room, I assume. It's basically it's... like one long, low room with a couple of extra rooms on the end that are very small. It looks like it's almost like a bunkhouse. Okay. All the beds are destroyed. Anything that was in here that meant anything is destroyed. Oh, well. That was a waste of a really good roll. It smells... I see nothing. ...sweet and rotten. Like, As there's... There are blood stains everywhere. There are also chewed bones strewn around the room. Ooh. What type of bones? Uh, make me a healing check. Yeah. Uh, chat fishing vampires on you. Probably just a teenager's room. <laughs> nice one there. Hey, one of them asked if there was a map available because they can only see us. Ah, yes. <laughs> I, can switch. I can switch, although the map isn't very good because there isn't an outbuilding on it because it's a map I found on the internet, not an actual map of this thing. Let me do tactical. Yeah. Now you can see a map. <laughs> not the map of where they are, but it's close. Let's just say that this area here is outside where they are. There we go. Beautiful. It's all about theater of the mind. Theater of the mind. <laughs> okay. All about making shit up as you go. Oh, look. Chat says it's you're all so pretty. <laughs> oh. It's the bunny. Only, now you're only tiny. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's, it's the bunny. bunny. It's the they bunny. don't care about that's, us. So that's an 11 on medicine and a 2 on medicine. That's pretty terrible. Does that druid have any medicine? No. Maybe. Oh, Let's good. see. Good, good beginning. I have. <laughs> yeah, I don't really have. Oh. oh, there's a 22 on medicine. That's pretty great. Hey, I didn't waste my good roll. Oh, yeah. no, that's good. Um, these are definitely human bones, and they're definitely from more than one person. I give one to Kevin. And eyes you suspiciously. It's not what he would normally eat. You should make him a necklace out of them. That's not going to freak out people in town. Not at all. Mm -hmm. I'm wearing his little gator helmet and a, a human bone necklace. <laughs> we come in peace. We're friendly. <laughs> right. I mean, you're already kind of strange looking as a group, but <laughs> also have a frog who is your mascot that you found in a swamp and are currently adorning. The thing's not going to be able to move soon. I'm working on our flag. I'm sewing it in my spare time. <laughs> you have a flag. <laughs> yeah, our group flags. The, the, the cheese pizza Lunchables with Kevin so sitting on top of a slice of cheese pizza. <laughs> That's so funny. That's pretty funny. I have to imagine you're it's just like so the most elaborate flag ever. ever. <laughs> I get the impression Aaron is actually sewing this flag. Oh, no, 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 no. Missy is sewing the flag. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This room is destroyed. There's nothing worth finding in here at all. Damn it. Other than the human remains, of course. Okay. I mean, is I've this seen is the, the, the uh, servants' quarters, you were saying? This is the servants' quarters. It's, okay. it's basically a bunkhouse. Yeah. 
Episode. How is it destroyed? Is it like beaten up? Was there like a fight? Yeah, all of the furniture's broken. Yeah. And there's human remains inside that have been gnawed to the bone. Oh, shit. Can we okay. hear anything like in the background that sounds like it's hiding? Yeah, there's 10 things. No, we don't hear anything. It's not really <laughs> you rolled a good perception check. There's nothing else in here. It's basically a big long room with a couple of storage areas at the end. Well, I think we should deliver the heads back to their families. Head. There's only one head. head sorry. Okay. Single well, head. Yeah. It's a lady. Single head. A lady's head. Fancy. Okay. You're heading out? I don't know if y'all could hear my neck crack just then, but it was satisfying. Nice. <laughs> Sounds terrifying. I watch, I, guess I, I watch too many 80s movies for that kind of business. Like where you're, you, you, you snap your own neck? Uh, where people snap necks. They're just like, oh, okay. that, was the, that was the whole of 80s movies, is people jumping out and <laughs> snapping other people's necks. That was the entirety of the 80s. Watch any movie from the 80s that has a gun in it, and somebody's neck is getting snapped. I would really like to see a movie in the scene where someone tries to do a neck snap and then is like, I can't, I can't, I can't get it. It's just, it's not right. That would be hilarious. And then, and then they get like, not neck snap, but like maybe they like throw them back and they crack their skull or something like that. Yeah. I don't know. It's it's just it's something that in movies is like always successful. You don't ever see it fail, but it's got to fail sometimes. It can't oh, they're be. heavily trained to snap. That's all they're trained in. It's okay. Class. Just the entire class. <laughs> it's like a whole class. Yeah. Right. I mean, you see this guy turns around and holds his head and go, "You've given me some serious whiplash," but doesn't actually die. B minus. <laughs> Tomas minus and I, we we have this we have this jar of mustard. That uh, just will not open. <laughs> like yeah. I keep really? thinking, uh, yeah, we've, we've worked on it two times now, so and I guess we'll work on it. <laughs> have, you have you run it? Have you run it under warm water? That's what I oh. told. That's what I said to do. Oh, take yeah. a shot. Got to be mad at it. Stab through the lid and it'll open. Oh, oh, through it? I haven't done that. I would suggest just trying the warm water trick. Okay. Hot water, right. let it pour on there. Yeah, it goes like another You put the top of it in there and you go. Zap it. It's just an impressive jar at this point. It's kind of amazing. And if you don't mind a hole in your lid. I, I kind of do. It's a big jar of mustard. I'm not going to get rid of it in one go. All you do is you put a bit of. Uh, <laughs> not with that attitude. Right? You should get a spoon on everything. You better get started. All right. Sorry. Oh, don't just apologize. It's all good. Distracted. So I, I mean, that's what you need when you're eating your human remains. Yeah, mustard. <laughs> that would that would cut a lot of this fattiness. They're very fatty. I mean, we're not cooking much here. <laughs> cool. Uh, uh, hello, Eric. <laughs> Hi to Eric. Hello, Eric. Hello. So. You are returning to town with a head that you found in a place where you shouldn't have been. <laughs> On a silver platter. <laughs> Hello, constable. I brought you something. That's really terrible. <laughs> um, that's really terrible. So, I brought you dinner. I mean, just kidding. We still got that head. That's pretty awful. So, the constable. You know where his house is. Are you heading there? Thing. So I think we need to uh, at least tell about the attack, you know, just all the damage we saw, and then here's the head that we found, and just to kind of explain. Does the constable already kind of think we're suspicious? Does he? Does maybe <laughs> the we want to go to. I mean, he is the law <laughs> here, right? But I thought he was helping us or something. Didn't we well, already talk to him? At first he, he did nice? ask us what we were doing there, but then he told us all about Sort of what was going yeah. on. Yeah. And he hasn't arrested you yet. Not yeah. yet. <laughs> All right. He hasn't. I mean, even if he did, where's he going to put you? <laughs> he doesn't have a place big enough for you all. <laughs> yeah. His house, I think it's big enough for two. Sweet. It'll just be me and Alec. <laughs> you, find him, you find him sitting on a chair outside his house. Oh, is is our is our dude following us? 
Yes. From well, he's in town. He's, he actually walked back out. He walked away from you. He's back in town. Oh, good. Is he? Is he, is he just he, the walls Does now, he or? see us and then like follow us, or is he just? <laughs> is he stuck on someone else now? No idea where he's gone. Why do you want to? You want to like show him the head? So mean. That is so. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Look, what? Look, treat for you. Look how great this is. Oh, that's so cool. That's like lawful good. You're like the only like pillar of law in this entire party. Stop making terrible suggestions. <laughs> Any kind of good alignments as soon as we came into the house. That's pretty terrible. <laughs> Somebody make a string numbers. It's my hand. Um. Oh, the constable sat outside his house. You don't have to stop at him. The last time you lost Luke, he ended up at the bar. Right. Just sat okay. inside. Um, no, I think we... I don't, I don't know. I think we should stop at the constable. Guys. Guys, do you Yeah, I, I agree. Thief but... says we should go to the, the constable. Just hand herself in. The, with a freaking disembodied head. <laughs> the world. All right, let's do it. Okay. So we come with bad news. Constable Grumman stands as you approach. What, what's going on? It wasn't good. We tried to take our Instagram follower back to the <laughs> to the estate. Go one Instagram follower. We're just, we're very private, and we have a private account. We only post for ourselves. And so uh, I'm afraid, but he, he would, he, one, he wouldn't follow us, but we needed to investigate because it was just such an odd thing. And they, you know, we were hoping that they'd be home again, but they, they weren't this time uh, either. But we were attacked by things with long tongues and long nails. Blue really? like creatures. Yes. One of them paralyzed our poor. Druid over here. This giant. They desk. broke the windows. We did not. <laughs> <laughs> like forensic team out there right now. <laughs> I need so, fingerprints. We. <laughs> Marcel's out there. Did you see him? We we dispatched of the ghouls and then went into the house trying to find anyone who might possibly need our help or might be un under attack themselves, and that's when we found. The <laughs> <laughs> <gasps> oh, no, it's Jeannie from the bar. We were missing. hoping. Oh, uh, I'm sorry to confirm. Ago. Looks like she was made a meal to to turn people into ghouls. Remember, That's what we think's going on. Earlier today, I think it was her that was taken. Then, oh, bloodstain. I bet it was her. She was reported missing. Hmm. Another strange tale. It's not good. Icarus we also checked blood. out the servants' quarters, and there seemed to be a fight in there as well, too. It's just it's not good over there at the estate. That sounds like something terrible's moved in. I do worry for the brothers. I haven't seen Marcel or Jean for a while. Days, weeks, even. We did find other remains there. <clears throat> so but we dead. were not Jean identifiable. It's Jean he hasn't seen. Okay. Oh, right. Marcel's the one that wrote the wrote in the books. Didn't he die? Yes, Marcel yeah. is dead. But John, John is, is missing. Alive. Marcel is, yes, and Marcel is dead. We're sorry for this terrible news. We're going to try and keep figuring this out. Okay. I mean, at least we found maybe where these have been going. You say you killed, dispatched the creatures. Three of them, yes. The ones that were there think there's more do we need to get a posse up i think it might be a good idea to have a watch out for sure ah, i think you're probably right i'll get the men together and we'll put together a watch sexist cooking for when the men come back after watch oh my god <laughs> <laughs> I'm burning this town down when I'm there. <laughs> you're, you're like, on second thought, fuck this. <laughs> yeah, fuck all y'all. <laughs> oh, he has two people in his watch, and both of them are men. Cool. Hold two people. Mm -hmm. Mighty. Seems like a very small watch. Hmm? It's a small posse. 
<laughs> Enough to watch a night. Oh, oh, nice people nice. Oh. Thanks you. He shakes your hands and says, thank you. Um, I'm sorry. Hopefully these with these things gone, these terrible, terrible murders or disappearances will stop. Oh, and the campaign's done. Well, the end, we figured yeah. it out. Congratulations. <laughs> you people. Well, you did great. That was amazing. Congrats. You did say you wanted a short one. <laughs> so to speak. I do think Alec mentioned a great word just now when he was like posse. I think instead of being like a group or something, we should be a posse. We should. <laughs> oh, do you want to be uh... a... <laughs> you can have the rest. I thought we were the lunch. We're the lunch. We can be the lunch posse. Yeah. Posse. Cheese posse. Cheese, 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 pizza, cheese pizza, pizza lunchables, lunchables posse. posse. Yeah. Because <laughs> we need more words. We do. Right. Yeah. <laughs> oh. It's because nobody can draw for your banner, so you just put the name on it and it takes a bunch of the space. <laughs> it's just like this it's a giant banner. With just like text on it. Yeah. We have a group name. It's the. I don't even know what it is. Pizza we keep adding words to it. It's gonna, it's gonna end up Pepperoni like uh, Daenerys. Pizza. Daenerys will be like Mother of Dragons, Stormborn, <laughs> Breaker of Chains. That's right. That was like half. That, that was half the episodes, right? When they actually. It's just list there. adding their all of her titles. Yeah. Well, we, can't, we can't think of how to write this story. Let's just fill fifteen minutes with this. <laughs> Accurate. Pretty sure mm -hmm. that's what happened. Sure, and I still haven't finished it. It'd probably still be better than season eight. Oh. We we gave up at the end of seven. You might as well just not watch it. That was a good move. That was a good move. I foolishly went into mm -hmm. eight with hope, like a dumbass. Uh, we, oh, yeah. we gave up when people started <laughs> teleporting around and nobody was using scouts to actually. Right. That was around. so weird. People, like, oh, yeah. armies just arrive in front of cities, and we're like, how did they? Because in the first few seasons, it would take them like episodes to get down yes. the goddamn country, and then all of a sudden, it's oh, like, oh, we're just there. there. And I mean, yes, they had boats, but seriously, somebody's watching that, you would hope. They also had a TARDIS. Yeah. <laughs> Found those magic portals. Okay, what are you doing now? Well, this I don't know. What are we doing now? <laughs> <laughs> That's That's very good question. question. <laughs> <laughs> what next? Back in town, right? Yeah, back in town. In town. Yes, we are back in town. You want partying at the bakery or the carpenter? <laughs> we want to go do uh, karaoke. <laughs> yeah, the only place that might have karaoke, no, there's no way that has karaoke. It's the full moon. <laughs> I was like, Mike, can we roll for this? Can we <laughs> no roll for karaoke? Is it karaoke night? This is karaoke. <laughs> oh, it's open mic night. <laughs> oh, even there's, better. There's a slam poet on. There's a performance for Oh, all. sweet. I'm gonna I'm gonna play some spoons oh. after this. Not good at karaoke as turns out. performance. <laughs> Chat, Chat's singing to you. Oh, <laughs> <my God. laughs> love, love and feeling. Oh my lord. Okay, where are you going? <laughs> That's exactly how that, that that could actually be made with more hair. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I have that shirt, but it's good enough. <laughs> okay. Where you going? Hey. Hmm. So that's really it. Like that's all that was in that that whole manor is just that was old. everything that was there. Yes. Should well, we should we try to find out if she was targeted specifically? If if certain people are being targeted? I mean, we don't know anything about any of them. Oh, like a correlation, you mean? Between yeah. Them? Yeah. Do they have anything in common at all? And the licorice. And when was when oh, was she yeah, taken? Oh yeah, about the licorice. Yeah, the, the licorice. licorice. It's licorice. I assume we didn't see any licorice at the house, right? What you saw? No, no licorice at the house. Interesting. 
I mean, no probably, head blood. <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe the head was pasted More. in licorice. <laughs> oh God! <laughs> what if we make a licorice trap with the head oh, and some licorice? Like a box and a stick. You hide around the corner with some licorice under it. Exactly. <laughs> yes. Put a sign that says free licorice. Yes. For monsters. <laughs> free licorice for monsters. I like that. And then wait, when somebody goes, you pull the stick and then you were done. Yeah. Maybe yeah. Done. Constable. Yeah. We can get out of a cardboard box. Whoop, whoop, whoop. It's in the box. Well, we all know what's in the box, right? It's Gwyneth Paltrow's head. Yeah. <laughs> She's I just like trying to get a jade egg in her pussy. It's no big deal. <laughs> no, she's probably trying to get one out of there by now. She's, uh, <laughs> at least three or four of her. Must be super uncomfortable while she's steaming it when the egg gets hot. <laughs> the lady's crazy. Just going to say. Don't listen she to is. That. Especially she is. about health stuff. If you've got a serious injury, do not oh, just rub turmeric on it. Actually go to a doctor. Nah. nah. Turmeric's the way to go. Oh, I thought you said turnips. Yeah, don't and turnips. turnips on it either. Both. You make a you make a turnip paste with some turmeric. That's right. And that's and that's what you use. Yes. Turnip turmeric paste. Ribble. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um We gotta we gotta check it out to make sure whatever's whatever was uh <laughs> this place is, is gone for good, so we gotta stay at least one night. So let's find something to do till then. I think we idea. should. Let's go check and see if my armor is ready. I, I guess, guess we could, could actually set you say it was gonna take a few okay. days to get your armor ready? Speaking yeah. Of... It's been like one day. It's been a, a few hours. And you're like, yeah. you ready? <laughs> this is like the day you dropped it off, right? You dropped it, it off in the morning. <laughs> Man, I got oh, many virtues, and patience is not one of them. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you get a poultice, guys. <laughs> no, I, I, can't, I can't drink this until someone makes us drink. I'm thirsty. Scream. A scream shatters the quiet afternoon, echoing through the village streets. Cool. Make me a wisdom checks, please. Oh, I got all the wisdom. Oh yeah, forty on the wisdoms. Yeah, eighteen on the wisdom yeah, for the wise, wholesome cleric. Mm. Four. Um, yes, and that's the end of the good <laughs> roll run. Congratulations, <laughs> everybody! Drink. Thank you. Hey. <laughs> Oh, maybe I can do a scream. Hold on, see if I can. Hey. Thank you for what your contribution. Oh. Oh, You're welcome. welcome. <laughs> Missy the wisest? Is, are you the wisest there, Missy? I am quite wise. I have hey, learned hey. on the streets that bad smells are generally dead by. <laughs> Shouldn't eat those. <laughs> Whoa, how did yeah. you figure that one out? Crazy. <laughs> Um, so, wait, did we do two drinks? Were we supposed no, to? No, just the one. That's two. Thank oh. you, Fang. Yep. Thank you. Um, half the group thinks the scream came from one direction, and the other <laughs> half thinks it came from the other direction. Well, obviously. Which one's my other. direction? Right. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, which one is the side that had all the good rules? <laughs> Which one yeah. is that side? <laughs> uh -huh. Are you splitting up? Cover the ground? No. Oh, never no. 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 No split. Okay, so you better talk it out. It's this way. It's that way. It's this way. It's that hear way. scream. That Left. way. Right. right. Okay. Oh. I didn't even hear it, so. Let's go this way. <laughs> Everybody heard it. <laughs> We're just like, was that a train? I'm <laughs> 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 following Karu. She oh yeah, do like... I get to start rolling for Kevin? What? 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 Not, not for I'm, wisdom I'm... check to figure out a direction of a screen. No. I'm following Karu. Like, like perception. I will, I will, I will make him a sheet for you. 
Kevin gets a sheet. Oh my god. You're getting to that point. I feel like he needs a sheet. It's going to be very short. Stop it. They might retaliate tomorrow night. <laughs> might. <laughs> There's no might involved. There's more, more of them than you. <clears throat> the only person that's going to be sober tomorrow night is Tim because he's drinking water. <laughs> Uh -huh. A reading terrible haiku he found on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Sounds like a good time. Isn't it though? Okay. Which way are you going? To the left. Who's put left. Who's putting forward yeah. the best argument? Thank you why you're correct. I'm just following Kairu all the time. Kairu is the good group, or the bad group is the question. <laughs> I did right here. Good, good luck figuring that out. Okay. I don't even know. I've got it. I've got We're it. going left. Going left. You head off left following Cairo. Some of you think it was in the other direction, but at least it's a decision. You dash off. <laughs> oh, I think you're about 100 paces down the street, looking up and down the alleys when you hear another scream clearly from behind you. And nothing in front of us? Oh. Oh, Turn around. Clearly with the uh, wrong Turn around and dash down the street. <laughs> down a side alley, you find a woman's body in a pool of her own blood. Oops. Damn it! <laughs> and there are six pieces of licorice scattered around the court. Do we recognize her? Oh, uh, make the. Uh, is it investigation? Me an investigation or insight check? You take uh, Shaggy and Scooby, and I'll go this way with Daphne. You're on to you, Fred. We know what you're doing. Right. Oh, I should have rolled insight. Can I change mine? Sure. Wow, I really should have rolled insight. <laughs> you like, can I change it? <laughs> I mean, she did. She at least asked before she even saw the result. So there is that. Yeah. <laughs> A wise cleric realizes that he saw this woman, say woman, she's quite young, young lady, um, in the inn. But she wasn't serving, but she was associated somehow with the inn. Meanwhile, the dipstick for a bog is like, look at that dead dog. Ooh, tree. <laughs> <laughs> I am a druid. We, call for the, we should call the constable over. The constable is arriving literally as you turn around. Okay. Look what happened! Uh, we just quick, here. Quick! Oh, spread out and search! Spread out and search! Okay. You can't be far away. You! Kevin. He po points at um, Tomas. Do something mm. for her! And he dashes off into the. <laughs> dashes off down the street to try and find. Uh, help. He's blowing you are a, a whistle. doctor. Blowing a whistle. Uh, pointed at you because you're, you're the obvious cleric, right? But is she is she alive at all? Is she dead? A medicine check. A medicine check. <gasps> Triple, you're moving. What's that bunny doing? Bunny cam. He's moving. I think she's dead. Wonderful. She's Aww. dead. I think she's dead. Because <laughs> you rolled so low. <laughs> she would have lived if you rolled higher. <laughs> Great big hole in that is generally a giveaway here. She's it's unfortunate. You have a raised dead spell? See, she's fine. Uh, <laughs> he, has, he has a create undead spell, which is basically the same thing around here. Cure wounds should work, right? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Don't think so. You're not curing that one, not one that big. <laughs> well, damn. What are you doing? You dashing off down different alleys in uh, separating the path? Yeah, I guess, it, yeah, I'd, I'd like to follow, follow his advice. Okay. You um, dash off down the alleys. Everybody can make the perception Ooh. checks. Okay. Or, oh my yeah. God. <laughs> can I roll one for Kevin? No, because <laughs> he can't talk to you. Kevin's not a great searcher of things. Oh, I don't know. Maybe can't you roll one for Kevin? 
I haven't got it. We'll make a sheet for Kevin for next time. <laughs> I, I just like to say to the group now, before I do that, he is going to roll higher than you on everything every single time. <laughs> Damn it. Damn so that's it. how that shit works. My, my group in Pathfinder has a tiger and he hits more often than the rest of the group. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he doesn't do a lot of damage, but he does hit a lot more. Especially more than Tim, who, when he hits, does obscene damage, but never hits. Aw, poor Tim. And it's not through lack of trying. Not through lack of trying. So... Well, we all try. All vanish off and search around, uh, looking up and down the alleys, up and down the streets. It seems I'm not like searching very hard. hard. Seems like the he's not searching very hard. I don't want to find this murderer. <laughs> I'm like, oh, why? I don't want to find the murderer. Been at this all day. Please, no mur no murderer, please. Hashtag blue tip. Needs a blue tip, please. Um, you search. You don't find anything. There's no trace of him Damn. anywhere. The whole town is turning out and searching with you. Um. Um, the priest that you saw at the funeral arrives and looks at her, nods at you, and starts to give her rights. Aww. Do they sound like rights, or do they sound like some sort of create ghouls bill in Cognito? <laughs> you can make me an arcana check if you want that kind of knowledge. Or a religion. The arcana to figure out that. Create undead. If he's casting great undead on her. Oh, Licorice no. also looks tasty. Oh my god, I can't roll for shit today. Do I know <laughs> if it would be seen as insensitive if I eat some of the licorice? It is It is in the blood pool, so that would be a bit okay. disgusting. All right. I've literally okay. rolled a one, <laughs> a nice. two, and a three. Back to back. So, do so I roll four saying? next? I mean, what you're saying is you want me to give you a few more rolls before combat, right? Yes, please. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I'll just start rolling perception decks and give them the number back up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, so, I see anything. anything. I see anything. Exactly. <laughs> so, you, you all search. Um, no, it isn't a spell of any kind. He seems to be... Um, holding is, it all, is it all... Is it all that we've asked? All in common. Oh, well, I mean, did you ask? Or you were just, you were just listening? Oh. Okay. <laughs> Whoa. All right. So the girl's getting her rights read. And we didn't find anything in our search. Did we find anything? Like, not even the murderer, but like bloody footprints or anything? Oh, there aren't anything. There's nothing. Literally no trace. Literally mm -hmm. nothing. Shit. Almost like he vanished into thin air. I mean, if he's a vampire, he probably flew away. It's the daytime. Oh, he's not a vampire. Like I said before, sometimes things here that should only come out at night don't only come out yeah. at night. Yeah. No, we know this is a special area. Sun, so like, is pretty, sun seems pretty weak. Bad. Yeah. And also, y'all's connections to your gods and stuff are weaker or feel distant or something, right? I don't have a hmm. Same. What up? <laughs> I have uh, like connection to nature though. Does mine feel weaker or does it still feel pretty no. tight? I feel nature here. You feel connected to creatures oh, I and mean, trees and the sky and the earth. Okay. Aww. You well, can good. paint with the colors of the wind. You're amazing. <laughs> okay. Reliable caster. The rest of them quite unreliable. Um, <laughs> you're listening to the priest as uh, asks him to his beseeching ill mater to look after this lady. He calls her Lilan. Mm, Lilan. Lilan. Oh, that's a cool. Name. Yeah. Uh, Excuse me, Lilian. Close enough. You can call her Lilan if you like to. Yeah, it's cool. Uh, hmm. So the constable, we didn't the catch the returns. killer. The constable Thanks. returns to the group. Couldn't find him. Yeah. It's away every time. 
It's the closest we've been, though. She's still warm. What? Body we found, too. Normally, we only get blood. Liquorice. How does he make his escape? Where is Where does he go? I don't know, but he takes the body with him every other time. This is the first time we've got here and there's been a body. Hmm. Have the bodies all disappeared roughly the same place, or has it been all over town? Everywhere. Generally, when somebody's walking on their own, I've tried to tell people, don't walk on your own, but you know what people are like. They think their individual freedoms are more important than the good of everybody else. <laughs> Whoa, relatable. <laughs> Preach, constable. <laughs> Preach. <laughs> so right. It's the road of fire. So, All right. Well, thank you for helping, though. It was good of you. The town saw you helping, so they're probably not going to think you did it. Hey. I'll put in a good word. I would definitely be careful. Try to stay above Bob. They know you brought that head back, so poor Jeannie. <laughs> oh, motherfucker. I can wild shape. I forgot we were level two. <laughs> I thought we were still level one. Motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty sure that word's banned in Druidic. It's probably not a word for it. Oh, how much experience do we have for a zombie fight? A cool fight. I'll give you experience for that fight. I have absolutely no idea. I haven't yet, but... I'm sitting at 466. I don't know if that was before or after that fight. That's after, because the gigantic after. crocodile fight took you over, and then you added a bit more yeah. and got to 400. Okay. Hey, we got our XP last time. Um, and turn invisible. Yeah, apparently that would be helpful. I can turn invisible. You can be an invisible creature, like a wolf. <laughs> oh. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? What you gonna do? <laughs> what you gonna do when they come for you? They are taking the somebody brought the cart, and they're taking the body to the church. Is this going to be the, like, do they try and bury it very quickly in the chains and stuff, or do they wait for a while? They, they generally Are, sorry, I guess I should ask the, the, the constable. But, you know, uh, generally, generally, we try and bury them very quickly in case they decide to um, come, come back. Yeah. Like, like the one guy. guy. Like some quite coffin. unquiet. Like the, yeah, like the shaky coffin. Yeah, I mean, sometimes. Is he still buried? The family's a bit forward thinking. What they'll do is they'll, you know, put a stake through their heart and stuff their mouth with garlic and sew it shut. You know, the traditional things. Does it help? Sew their eyes closed. Sometimes. I mean, mostly if you do that, at least they smell better when they come back. <laughs> <laughs> like garlic. Garlic's amazing. Garlic is Girl's banging on the door to get in. Like. Hmm. Maybe if we haven't talked to the priest too much yet, right? No, you haven't talked to him. We talked to the grave digger. We talked to the grave digger, but you're not yeah. So I recognized her from the inn, right? Yes, you recognized her from the inn. So perhaps we should <laughs> go to the inn. And he escaped. As you're, as you're thinking about it, should we go? Should we go to the inn? Um, you see someone dashing down the street. From the direction, from where? From the direction of the inn. From the inn or to the inn? From the inn. From the inn. From I'm gonna give chase. Give Just chase. Get following that. Oh, they're, they're coming towards you from the I inn. Oh, okay. I go towards them. Okay. Why are you All running? You see is here. There's two people running towards you. Both of them look incredibly distraught. Oh, uh-oh. Um, you recognize them as the innkeeper and his wife. Oh, no. They just dash past you. And they go past us? What's they're happening? Like, hey, what are we running, running from? from? What's, what's going on? Is it our daughter? Is it our daughter? Is it uh, Lila? Uh, you guys are uh, 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 Yeah, no. She, um, yeah, um. Uh, 
no, they start crying and hugging each other. And as they see the priest, he kind of nods at them. And they're taking her body in a cart covered in a sheet down to the church. We will find who did this. And we will maybe get justice, but we <laughs> maybe. Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe get justice. We're going to try. Yeah, We're going to uh, try. We'll see. Try <laughs> We're not promising. <laughs> Um, they take it to the church. Are you going down there? A uh, family are following. A few other villagers are following. A lot of people are kind of sad, but only the family are crying. It seems like all of this kind of death and disappearance has kind of annealed them a bit to these kind of events. <clears throat> I to follow. Maybe they're, maybe they're just tough as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> what you doing? You going down to the church? Yes. Yeah. Church. church is a relatively large building, which I can actually show you on the map. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. If I got the right screen, I can absolutely show you on the map. Let's pull you <laughs> from to, where am I taking you? I'm taking you there. Taking you to there. Ooh. The hand drawn. Yeah, it's like an old hand draw map from the original book. Back in the day when they didn't have nothing fancy. And it were just, you know. Lame. It was just lame. Well, it's just some <laughs> guy writing something that he wanted, that he loved, that he desperately needed to produce in the world. And hey, that was furry porn. <laughs> That's what happened when the internet was made. Okay, hey, this large building. I do love how I've, I've got all the members on this. I kind of want a good thing about uh, all 20. This building here. Yep. The church. the church. And then the graveyard right behind it, right? The big right. old field. Square right there is the graveyard. Yeah. So you get to the church and. Um, it is loud. She must have had three quarters of a bottle of wine. <laughs> <laughs> is that her talking? Yeah, you can hear her in the background. That's yeah. The <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, oh, no, that was Leah talking. So <laughs> you uh, approach the church. The the priest unlocks the door and they take mm. the body inside. And um, family go inside and the villagers just kind of mill around outside. I'll go mill around and listen to what the villagers are saying. They're just yeah. whispering to each other about various yeah. things. You think they're talking about rumors again? You know, there's all kinds of stuff that they're talking about. I just hope mm. it wasn't. I'm glad it was her and not one of the others. I've been, uh, you know, trying to make my way with that other barmaid. That <laughs> kind of. <laughs> How important uh, village stuff. Um. I hope it wasn't that vampire again. He's eaten now. Okay. We'll get Nights of peace. Yeah. Four nights of peace. Four triple go. Nights of peace. Nights of peace. Oh. Empty, empty thing. There's an empty. Uh, like that. Body Rabbit cam. Run. Run, 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 rabbit, run. He doesn't run, go run, far. Run, don't good worry. Good bug. Run, 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 run. <laughs> uh. I really, I find it interesting that they're talking about another vampire. What do y'all want to do as a group, though? Um, y'all want to talk to the villagers and stuff, or? <laughs> Aww. Put him back in his, get back on camera, you little terrible rabbit. Back to the rabbit. You hunting rabbit. Um. Duck season. Rabbit season. Duck season. Rabbit season. It's good. Um, the, the villagers are also seem to be talking about cultists in the swamps who worship the Lord of the Dead. So that's Man, I doing. thought you said contests. I was like, ooh. Contests, in, contests, yes. You can win great thing. Good. Big prizes. <laughs> crocodiles. You can win Corona. crocodiles. Gigantic crocodiles. So we can all have mounts is what you're saying. 
That's right. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> what are y'all thinking? <clears throat> After about ten minutes or so, I have no uh, idea. The innkeeper and his wife come out of the church, and the priest steps onto the lintel. He steps onto the the lintel. Yeah, that's the bit that runs the the middle of the church. He stands he stands in the doorway. Okay. He doesn't say anything. He just stands there. <laughs> I was light. like, and <laughs> <laughs> welcome. I am Shaman Brucian, humble cleric of Ilmeta. Hmm. Can I help okay. you? I understand oh. the ones that found this poor young oh. woman. Sorry, I didn't know. Yeah, hey, what's up? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what's up, man? Only, only briefly before the constable showed up. Um, but yeah, we also that's... found... Don't worry. I, this I other know person you. whose name I forgot. The at, the, at the estate. Eenie. The head. Eenie. 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 Ah, yes. She went missing last night, the night before. It's been hard to keep track of the troubles of this place. Does it so tend to be separate. women? No, or... it's been a mix, but often women, yes, more so than the men, I think. Hmm. Maybe they are more, to more, often, or more often. I don't know. At night, perhaps, they're easier targets on their own. It's almost mm -hmm. daytime. Yes, he's getting bolder. It's strange. <laughs> Do we notice. think it's a single person? I, I've never I think seen... think it's a person at all. Anyone. Okay, a single entity. It looks like knife wounds from what I can see. I have been in the mm. battle with a, a blade. Wait, uh, so you've seen, seen them before? No, I've seen some of the... I've seen battle wounds before. Oh. This is definitely a knife wound here. On Milan. Mm -hmm. Rest, we have never seen a body. He takes them with him. We don't know. Why was this time different? different? Maybe you were quick enough to get there before he could take the body away. It can't be easy to spirit a body out but of He can't be house. very far away then, right? Where? Well, no. I mean, he may be in one of the buildings. Hmm. We already kind of looked through the city. We were trying to find him just to see if we could bottom somewhere near the body. We weren't able to do that. Good we would like to help good solve in. this problem and, and stop these murders from happening. Definitely. Yes. It could um, be. He's, he looks like a normal person. Yeah. Maybe he doesn't smell like a normal person. Maybe I could turn into a bloodhound and try Take to... your sniffers <laughs> out. <laughs> Clearly she died of... <laughs> Maybe that's why the licorice... No, it was just pneumonia. It wasn't COVID. One of the what, strangest things is the villagers that are dying just all of a sudden. And also these disappearances. I think they're linked somehow, but I don't know how. And we also heard you have a problem with cultists in, in, in the swamp as well. I think that's idle banter. <clears throat> villagers, mm. villagers hear and see things. They see a man in a robe or they see a man with a hood who's coming through with cattle and they think he's they they try to chop one head off of one chicken and boom you're a cultist so it is a cthulhu theme got it it's always the cultist i mean there's there's been also the the rather large increase in the um the dead coming back shall we say yeah. but quiet and quiet dead try my best to keep them down, but often chains is all we can use. I saw, um, three weeks ago perhaps, a field worker named Hogarth. <clears throat> died, literally just fell dead. Hogarth? Okay. And then minutes later, minutes after falling to the ground, rose as a dead creature. It was terrible. Could he That's talk? exciting. I mean, since then, I've been sealing the coffins as tightly as possible for the recently dead, just in case, but never seen anyone come back that fast. That is strange. We heard, um, well, we, 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 we fought some ghouls over at the estate. Um, 
and then and we I do think you have an undead problem here, sir. Yes, right. <laughs> he walks over to Luke, who's walked up behind you and puts his hand on his shoulder. Our follower, yay! Oh. Puts his hand on his shoulder and and what squeezes? This poor boy, he is a lost one. A lost one. He seems to have taken a liking to you. He seems to have taken mm -hmm. a liking. Unfortunately, we're a closed group. We're really not. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, we do not have an opening right now. Well, your gigantic frog. <laughs> we had an opening for a frog, and that position has been filled. <laughs> So you happen to know where his, where his family is? I, I don't. John, I haven't seen in a long time. Marcel is... There, there is a tail. Come inside, please. Oh, dear. Do we have hot chocolate? I can make some tea. I can make some tea. Tea's very good. Mm -hmm. You go inside the church, it is stark. Benches mm. look purposefully uncomfortable. The floor is stone. The place is cold. So, so like most churches. Oh, this is particularly bad. Um, <laughs> he takes you down to the end and sits on the pew at the front. The pew is particularly uncomfortable. It was clearly made of... He found, found the hardest, splinteriest wood he could find and then just nailed it together. <laughs> <laughs> so let me tell you a few things um, that happened you seem to be the best chance this place has of getting <laughs> he doesn't know what he's saying I'm gonna say I'm like, you're doomed you're doomed <laughs> <laughs> it's about piety, not comfort. Well, it is a church of Elmington, right? It's not about comfort, it's about suffering. Oh, suffering. <laughs> he, is, he is the Lord of Suffering. Um, what is it? The Lord on the Rack, he's called. Um, so, uh, El Tarascon um, was probably the first to die. Um... He um, he died. His brother Jean brought him here with Luke. I um, <sighs> yes, uh, things went awry, shall we say? And I tried to raise mm. him to come back, but we buried him. That broke Luke's mind and mass and yeah. <laughs> Beautiful. Was that in character? Yes, <laughs> in character. It's beautiful. It was a... I don't know, it was a hard night. I think it all started when Marcel died. It all started when Marcel died. Hmm. Where we was Marcel buried? Buried, <laughs> He was interred <laughs> up in the churchyard, up in the cemetery. Mm -hmm. Can can you point us to that? that one out. Yeah. No, no, unrelated. No, do you have any salt? Pack <laughs> salt. I'm gonna pack his mouth with that just to be sure. Get a garlic. Mm -hmm. um, Peppers. I mean, watching lemon. this whole incident broke Luke, and I took a little responsibility. It's just, I've been feeding him in the swamp once he ran that. But yes, he was interred up in the cemetery, but I don't think you're going to find him there now. Why wouldn't we find Marcel there now? Because I don't think he's there anymore. Yes, yes, we know he died, but... Found our was... vampire. His tomb was open, I... and his coffin was gone. Did they roll the stone away? Is he Jesus? <laughs> yes. Empire he's Jesus. Back. Vampire zombie Jesus. I always knew there was one. Mm. That's Mr. Dr. Vampire Zombie Jesus to you. <laughs> you can go up to Cemetery Hill and you can take a look, but all you're going to find is an empty mausoleum. 
Um, yes, yeah, let's, let's take a look. look. Yeah, let's do that. We can find some trace, trace of something. something. Yeah. You head up oh, the hill. Do you, want, um, do you want Shaman to come with you? Which is a great yeah. name. Yeah. Oh, come on, buddy. Doctor, we're back to Dr. Acular again. <laughs> Luke with us if we can. Yeah, Luke come on, Instagram follower. <laughs> Follow us. <laughs> That's a polite pace. Are you taking Shaman with you? Would you want the priest to come? Yes. Sure. If he leads you up and unlocks the gate and takes you inside, he kind of glances at the sky as he opens the gate, nods to mm. himself, and goes inside. It's that one. <laughs> it is clearly the largest mausoleum in the place. Is the, in the, like the custom where like the the bodies are rotated? Like perhaps his body would be in there for a while, and then it would rotate out yes. into the a the smaller reason, space. The reason the cemetery is on a mound like this is because the water table is so high. Mm. So it's Louisiana. Swamps. Correct. So what what traditionally happens is they bury someone in the wall of a mausoleum. So a mausoleum may have number of burial slots. And when somebody's dead, they kind of shuffle their coffin around okay. the bits through a grate, and then they slide into the way. So, <laughs> very Iron Age in my mind, but it's it's efficient. Angle side if they get if they stay there long enough. But he leads you to the mausoleum. It is clearly the the, the swankiest and nicest mausoleum here. The most prominent and well-tended. You... Maybe we should set up a... What do you all think about setting up a watch over at the estate? Maybe see if he goes home at some point. We could nab him. Nab him. <laughs> sure. I think we should check out the mausoleum first. We're, we're here. If there's any trap doors. There yeah, is not. there anything... Is there anything interesting around? Okay, let me get, just go and get my full red boy. Of course, we're gonna go the other extreme now. Nice. <laughs> right. Search around the mausoleum on the outside and the inside. You see that there is indeed an empty place where a body was probably recently put. You can see marks on the walls where the uh, plate was removed um, by probably. Hero, the groundskeeper, before the body was interred. Um, we miss you on Iron God, Zerim. Ah. Uh, uh, see, apparently. I'm a terrible were, player. <laughs> you were the best bully gook, apparently. Uh, <laughs> thanks. <laughs> so, looking around the outside, there's nothing there. It doesn't look like anyone's been in. Everybody drinks. Good call. <laughs> and now I need to top off my own. You stole a most of the wine. wine thief. I'm oh. getting pretty close to a random encounter for the other group. So I'm yeah, right. to my point. Oh, hold on. Yeah. <laughs> totally appreciate a gigantic, unkillable robot, I think. Oh. <laughs> Can we combine our points? Yeah, oh, that'd be cool. <laughs> like, Get them nice and drunk and then hit them with the random encounter. <laughs> so in courtesy of your Thursday night D&D group, here's a yeah, yeah. random encounter. You're welcome. <laughs> Is this a game of tag we want to start, though? Yes. <laughs> Someone already yes. started it with us. It's, so. it's, it's, <laughs> it's, it's been started. <laughs> we didn't start the fire, but we're adding gasoline. <laughs> exactly. I'm waiting for our next one. It's going to happen. So you're looking around the mausoleum. You notice traces of scratch marks on the stone on the outside. You actually see that on a few of the, ma of the mausoleums. It looks like something's been trying to scratch the doors open. Ooh, interesting. Cool. Yeah, looking for flesh. <laughs> Only 3k away from it. <laughs> oh, so, what are you doing? Guys, I'd kind of like to set up watch over at the plantation. 
See if this yeah. this fucker tries Stop to go home. Watch. I can turn invisible. Ooh. That's helpful. I don't know how long. But I'd, like, I'd like to ask the um the the the, the shaman or yeah, I know uh, he's a cleric, but he's called the cleric. Shaman, just to make things yeah. incredibly complicated. <laughs> That's really dumb. <laughs> if they've known sort of that the, these problems have started after Marcel was buried, um, have they not been looking for Marcel? Yes, I mean, okay. we've tried to find all of them. <clears throat> oh my god. Horrifying. <laughs> oh, horrifying. I named myself Missy Belchiet. It was right. correct. <laughs> horrifying. Um, we tried to find all of the dead that walked away. I mean, they need to be reinterred after being appropriately dealt with, but we could never find Marcel. It is a sad, sad mm. thing. Maybe you can find him for us. Mm. Maybe we can. I hope so. I mean, it would be good. <laughs> All right. I guess we can go back to the uh, plantation, as it were. Mm -hmm. I grasp my stomach and belch really loudly and shake the, the <laughs> hand of the, of the priest. I'm like, thank you. Thank you for your help. And I skedaddle out of there. Skedaddle away. <laughs> A so title for whom the belch tolls. It's a good one. <laughs> good. good one. I like that. I appreciate a literary pun. <laughs> I appreciate a literary pun. It's nice. You head out. Anyone else staying here tonight? Are you heading up to the plantation? Yeah. Okay, you're heading to the plantation. I want to set a watch. Setting a watch. Who is watching? Are you all going? Are only some of you going? I don't know. What do y'all think? I'll stay back in the inn. Mostly because uh, there's a more comfortable bed there. Um, but also I'll keep my ear out at the inn since, you know, <laughs> the inn was recently attacked, kind of. So. Fair. Yeah. So you're, who's staying back at the inn? Karu. Karu is staying mm -hmm. back at the Everybody else is okay. What are you doing, Fury? Oh, that just all broke up into nothing. What did you say? <laughs> oh, I said I'll go with you guys. Okay. The, the watch. House. Yeah. Okay. Alec, what are you up to? Oh, what, what is there to do? do? <laughs> <laughs> A <laughs> Wait. Wait. Oh yeah, my character. He's the more little one. I will follow the tall one. Or is a girl like girl? I want to ride that steed. Rocky steed. So terrifying. Have you tried to mount the frog? I'm trying to mount something. <laughs> <laughs> Are you? It's a uh, Alcanora, right? Alcanora, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Yeah. Well, I think Alcanora is going, so I guess the Ganoni yeah. is going. Where Where I go, Kevin goes. Cool, Kevin. Tomas, you gonna yep. stay with Karu or come? Oh, oh, no. Karu, you gonna stay by yourself? Are you still yeah, gonna stay at the end if it's Why only you? Stay? Okay. All right. Hold on, my door. Keep my ear open. No. <laughs> Craig again. Pushing. Craig, did you vanish? Did it vanish again <laughs> halfway through? Like, Craig no. goes. Craig, Craig died on us again. Craig. Suck. Craig. I'm gonna have to look for a better option than Craig. He keeps breaking. Press the digitation. What are you pressing? Sorry, I was just, I just clicked it on accident. Oh, okay. He's filling filling the box with text. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh huh. Exactly. Like it's good. Okay. You um, head off, all of you except for Caro, who is staying at the inn to get drunk and. Stribble. To be comfortable. Uh, Keep an ear out. I'm keeping my ear open for 
conversations that I hear about things or maybe Green. weird things, things that don't make sense, etc. Conversations. So you um, settle into the tap room for the evening. So the mood in the tap room is reasonably somber. They have lost their daughter today. But the inn is open and continuing as it was a thought that most people would need a drink. Mm. The rest of you tromp through the increasing darkness. There is rumblings in the sky as dark clouds form. Mm. The weather's been here a while and it hasn't. The weather's been here a while and it hasn't broken yet. Get to mm. the plantation. And um, it's dark. There are still some candles burning inside the house, but nobody seems to have tidied up anything of the mess you've left. I'd like to, I don't know, can I like put some wire traps around or something? Something where I can like get like an um, audible notice someone's trying to sneak into the house or something, right? Like, like it rings a bell. That's kind of what I was looking at for us to do. Anybody with survival can take a shot. Skill in this game now. Oh, I'm going to do that. Let me see if I have any survival. I'm going to do that on my door also. Yes. Survival. Can I Can I slide up hand this with my five tools? Roll the 19. That's for back at the end. Oh, you survived real great at the end. <laughs> well, I mean, like, I'm setting, like, a uh, audible trap or something. Oh, or, oh, or oh, whatever. I thought you sat yeah. in a room listening to peasantry. Well, I am. But, I mean, when I go to bed. Oh, I see what you're saying. Very good. Um, you right, the night. make some attempts at setting traps and things, noisemakers in the trees, things in the ground. I think you've done an okay job. Okay. It's not just good, it's good enough. <laughs> well, give them a book. <laughs> uh, where are you setting up? You have the main building, and then you have the servants' building. Both are filled with dead flesh, pretty much. The fire that you lit earlier today is still smoldering a little. It smells sweet and porky. Does there happen to be any trees or anything like that nearby? We can just like be outside of the main house, but near it, have like a vantage point around. I'm just trying to look for like what would give me a good lookout there some, spot. There are some scraggly swampy swamp trees kind of hanging around around the swamp, around the Ooh. house. I'm gonna it's climb one. It's reasonably clear. At one point, it probably had a very well tended garden around it, but now mm. there's the odd tree here and there, and there's a bank of trees. Maybe 100, 150 yards from the house itself. You hiding in the woods? Well, I don't know if it's that far away from the house, will I be able to see anything? Probably not. It's so dark. I don't Probably have dark not. vision or anything. So Definitely I, not. Yeah. I'd be in the house, but invisible. Yes, you can. I want to do that. Okay. Maybe just finding a room that doesn't smell too bad and setting up in there. Okay. I'll make a little mask. I'll wear a mask like you're supposed to. You can wear a nice. mask like you're supposed to. Okay. What about the rest of you? You're setting up in the woods. You're setting up in the house. Spreading guess... around all on your own. Makes me happy when the party do this. <laughs> so when we split it. Well, it's hard to hide all together as a group. A group? Um, no, it is. It's hard to do this. I kind of want to just hang out on the some type of porch area or something outside. I don't want to be inside the house, but I just want to be able to notice if anyone's approaching the house. Right, that makes uh, sense. Maybe the roof? Mm -hmm. Maybe on the roof? Yeah, on the roof. I'd be able to climb to the roof. Okay, I'll be on the roof of the house. Where's Kevin? I, I'm going to touch myself and cast <laughs> protection yeah. from evil. Protection from evil is good. How long does it last? I don't know. Um, Anybody Not long. Oh no. <laughs> Only ten minutes. <laughs> it's uh -oh. a karaoke night. <laughs> it is now. <laughs> it's our karaoke night. It's always the divine ones. So people prepare, you get yourself set up. Missy's on the roof. 
Um, Alcanor is inside and invisible. The rest of you are around the house, I'm going to assume. Sitting around, waiting to be stabbed in the spine. Front windows and doors and stuff. Yeah. Windows and doors. Cool. All right. We're watching. Poised and ready. Ready. Right. Is that how we're going to okay. be all like, like this. Capoeira from Bob's Burgers, season one. That's us. We're just like, hey, hey, hey. hey. It's fine. Just waiting for it. Okay, that's good. I've got a weapon. So. <laughs> Your butt. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> Your butt's also a weapon, so you, you had one anyways. <laughs> Back at the inn, the conversation has turned to murderers and things in the night and all kinds of terrible things that might be going on. And um, you get a lot of, lot of interesting tidbits. It seems like, honestly, most of the villagers have no clue what's actually happening. So it seems like everything started last three weeks or so. Um, villagers talk about nine sudden deaths. That have occurred literally people just dropping dead and of the nine who died seven were buried in sealed coffins but two escaped into the night one of them was marcel no well thank you new follower Yay. there is talk of an old cemetery that was sealed long ago when the new one was made but no one's been in it for decades. It's said that sometimes um, that people can hear sounds from that direction, but nobody's ever Let's there. go dig up the bodies. And <laughs> <laughs> that, say that the old cemetery is haunted by wraiths at night and that nobody should ever go there at nighttime. So, so we, we should definitely go there at nighttime. nighttime. Is what I I'd <laughs> totally go there at night time to kill the wraiths. Exactly, it's XP. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> right. there's, there's also um, somebody talking about uh, old Fiora. Uh, apparently, she had her um, fortune told by the Vistani when they were in town, and they told her that the night mm. of the dead was fast approaching. The night of the dead. Mm -hmm. Is there a specific date for that, or is it just kind of an occurrence? Oh, oh they know you never get specifics like that in fortunes. You should know that. I know. <laughs> okay, fine. Just write this down for you. Yeah, it's a specific date, time, telephone number. <laughs> also, find out what the GPS location. location. Yeah. Constable <laughs> Stone was the second to die, just falling to the ground with no reason. Which is why he's so distraught about this whole thing. Mm. And then they fall back into old tropes about vampires stalking the night. The usual things. Too spooky for me. Are you asking any specific questions? Okay, just thanks. listening to them banter. This is mostly listening. Drinking. Drinking, which we should be doing too. Oh, there you go. Everybody drinks. Good call. Apparently, I did it twice. Oops. Oh, no. Ah, <laughs> uh, cheap wine is cheap. So you're making so a lot of noise. People at the the plantation become tired. You sit down. You find chairs. The listening, the sounds of kind of crickets chirping in the night and frogs frogging in the night. <laughs> frogging. Frogs frogging. frogging. Frogs frogging. Let's see if I have a frogging sound. Yeah, frogging. 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 Yeah, where's Kevin? Inside I, with I, me. I just assume Kevin's with you. Okay. He's not invisible, though. So. No, he's not invisible. But I mean, a frog could have hopped in through the window, right? How much of that, that frog is in the window? Mm -hmm. Okay. You, um, there it goes. It's nighttime. Oh, yeah. 
Night time in the swamp. Um, Night time. In the swamp. Um, those at the plantation are settling in for a watch. Are any of you sleeping or are you all attempting to stay? Down in one, people. Oh, no. Down in one. Thank you, Fing. Oh, lucky me. Oh, I still I have, only have this one. Yeah. Hey, look at, look at this it's tiny empty. little. I get the feeling Erin's been for a new drink, which is going to be great for her when she, she gets back. Yeah. Thank you, thing. Oh, wait, does she have to drink the new one or the one Ooh, that, that she would, had? That would seem to be the rule because clearly she's gone for a fresh one, right? She's going to get back at you. Erin, did you just get a new drink? <laughs> No. Oh, you missed the down in one. Oh, cool. Okay. There now you gotta go get one. <laughs> she has to go. The timing. It's all about the timing. Failed. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Down in one. You get drunk over there. So, are you, setting, <laughs> heavy. are you setting watches at the plantation, or are you all going to try and stay awake all night? No. That was what we were doing, was we were trying oh, to... Oh, with different spaces, yeah. Oh, I see. Okay, that's fine. I'm just wanting to know if you're kind of watching or you're all staying awake in various places. All yeah, I think maybe house. if we had if we had stayed as a group, but... Yeah. Well, you kind of are. You're all in the house or on the house. So, <laughs> assuming everyone's kind of looking out a window... All of my glasses are literally on the house. Yeah, you're literally on the, like, snuggled up next to a chimney staring into the swamp. Mm. Okay, you all settle in for the night. At the uh, inn, it's starting to wind down. Your room is ready, as always. You go upstairs to see if there's something that kind of shuffles out the door. You go to your sleeping place. Which is a small awesome. room at the top of the inn. So, oh, the top. <laughs> Do we see anything in the night? Does anyone approach? Don't, but Karu does. As she closes the door to her room and turns around. Oh no! A bad man stands before you, completely what? Oh, no! black hooded cloak. Only the curved dagger in his pale hand is visible. Then he tosses back the hood, revealing a face twisted by madness and eyes lit by the fires of insanity. That fire is clearly consuming him, burning away what is left of his mind and his humanity. Ooh. You should not have come to marry de Tarscon, he hisses, and you should not have brought that whelp of a brother with you. He waves his dagger. You have forced this confrontation. Let the blood be on your hands as you taste the blade of Jean Tarascon. Uh, no thanks. Slams the door. <laughs> You're in the room. The slams the I door. opt out. Window I opt out of this. You know, the window behind him was open, but we will have to go to the initiative in order for you to do it. Which okay. includes... Ah. Which includes slamming the door. <laughs> Hold on, let me clear the initiative trick. Creature. Oh, do I want to do that? Yes, I do. Okay. Let's go. <laughs> Kill him, bunny. Well, I can't really click on myself or anything because we're not going sure. to get a bad madman Uber rate. <laughs> really? Bad madman. That's a thing. Roll initiative? You got a 16? 16. You did not select your token because you did not appear on my tracker. I can add that anyway. I don't have a token. So if she's rolling for initiative, can I go get oh, a Oh, your tokens aren't on this map. That would be me. Thank you. Thank you for correcting my terrible insight. John. If we're rolling for initiative, I'm going to go get a drink real quick. Oh, you should do that so Finn can make you drink it off. <laughs> yeah. wouldn't do that. Well, I got 15, so you go first by a one. Um, okay. Let me, let me see what I can do. 
I don't think I've got a map open for an in room at the moment. So, I don't know. So, he's obviously aggressive and looking to attack me, right? He is actually moving to attack you, and he already has a knife drawn. And he said the words, your blood is on your hands, in the sense that this is your okay. taste of the blade of Jean Tarascon. I'm in my room, correct? And this was, like, kind of as I was closing room, the door? Up. He is in the room. He's clearly climbed the wall and come in through the window. Oh, he's in my room, coming in through. He's oh, in okay. Room of your room. Got it. So I can, I can go back him. out and close the door. But I mean, he's you could also open the door. Right, right. But then I'm going to run back down towards, I guess, the lobby where there might be people. If you know most people were leaving, but you could try that. And the other thing is, generally, the inn would lock its doors at night. So you may just end up being murdered in the tap room instead of your bedroom. No, I see what you're saying. Okay. Uh, the people, the people who are here are probably the innkeeper, his wife, and maybe a couple of the waitresses. Would I have any idea where they would be? They probably have a room at the back of the house on the ground floor. All right, to the ground floor we go. You're running. So you slam the door and run. I slam the door and run downstairs as fast as Behind you, you hear the door being pulled open with great vigor, and you hear the sounds of booted footsteps right behind you. There's a little bit of a, almost a cackle as he kind of starts to close on you. You kind of, the steps are narrow and you kind of curve around. This is a terrible swamp sound, but isn't going to go well here. Yeah. Better, better, better place. Froggy. John gives off a swamp sound. Yeah, right. <laughs> we don't want that. What are we doing? He's like, ribbit, ribbit. 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 But you knew you should have kept with Kevin. Kevin the madman all along? Kevin was the madman all. He pulls back his herd and he's just a big frog. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> oh, come on. Let's try it. Hello, pig. Hello, oh, cute cat. Oh, pig. That'll do. Oh, there we go. That's creepy. Oh. Cheers, mates. Cheers. Okay. You dash Ooh. down the stairs. He's I'm right mad. behind you. you. Burst into the common room. Hey, kitty. Can I? While Did I was you running, just get another down in one. I'll be screaming to see if anybody will come out of their doors. If I get anybody, yeah. Okay, yes. Um, as you get to the common room, you hear the sounds of the family kind of getting up a little bit behind in, in kind of the back area. He's literally right behind you as you hit the ground. They're actually going to act on him, or you now have literally nowhere really to go. So now it would be he's about something. to attack, so I pretty much have like one, one attack before he hits to me. Okay. Stabs you in the face. That's so I will go room. ahead. And I guess just kind of start attacking him. Oh, cast. Let's see. I'm going to cast Ray of Frost. Of course. Of course. Oh, no. Of course. Shouldn't have left her alone. Of course. He's going to be a statistic. They have like ice knife and all that exciting stuff. I know, I know, but Ray of Frost also would have slowed his speed, so I. Uh, I'd say if you shot him and then ran. Right, or like as he was approaching more, I would turn around, hit him with that to slow him down, and then keep running. Yeah. Gotcha. But yeah, you know, of course, I rolled a one, so here we are. <laughs> miss him? You miss him? You did miss him. I'm sorry about that. You missed him. No idea what's happening. I'm being attacked. attacked. <laughs> my laptop is bazzing out. Oh, hey, no. Uh, oh no! Did we drink the great for Thing's last down in one? I did. Thing did okay. two. Ketchup no suckers. Oh wait, two. What? He did. He did two. He did a down in one, and then another down in one. It looked like. Hey, did you down in one twice, Thing? Let's oh. confirm it before you get pissed drunk. Oh yes. <laughs> 
I have work tomorrow, so my dad wants yeah, there's a second one. <laughs> there is. He said, he said, welcome back, and then it was another down and one. <laughs> down and one. Okay, well, now I have. Oh. Yeah, you were waiting for me, huh? My new, new drink. Smart. Thank you, thank you. We were trying to do that, too, but then you didn't get a drink. It <laughs> failed. <laughs> All right, he goes to stab you with his dagger of sharp stabbing. Stabby, stab, stab. What a name. Dagger of sharp stabbing. <laughs> fighting. And he rolls a 24 to hit you. That's that was gross. a tentacle. I'm guessing that's a hit. That was better um, than a one. Hey. <laughs> Run, Karu, run to the plantation. It's a long way to the plantation. It's okay. Yeah, I mean, that's just going to hit. There's nothing. Oh, that's it. Okay. It's a dagger. I'm trying. Is dagger damage 1d4 in this? Yeah. No. Oh, oh that's mine, it? Mine are 1d6, I thought. Really? Big daggers. <laughs> No, it's I'm okay. One. No, I'm one okay D4. with one D4. D4. That's fine. Yeah. One D4. Actually, I think I remember mine being like one D4 plus or something. Yeah, I just looked at it. It's it's one D4. Five damage. He stabs you skillfully in the chest or in the arm or whatever. Dodge a little, but it, Ow. it's a good hit. Cool, surgeon. The strength Ow. of madness. He cackles at you a little. Dude, I'm what hungry. I hit him with ice knife. It's fuck this. <laughs> Wounded. Okay, ice knife shoots out, and you. Okay, I'm assuming you step back and cast ice knife. Yes. Yes. There we go. I'm just let's in theater of the mind. I step back and cast ice knife. Okay, he needs to make a what? A dexterity saving throw. Thirteen. He will take the four anyway. Twenty-three. Uh, yeah, okay, fine. So he'll take the four anyway, yeah. Okay. He kind of staggers back from your icy knife. That would have been a great extra. That's yeah, ten right. extra. That I know. Nice. He kind of rallies and just attacks you through the detritus of ice on his chest. Once again, mm -hmm. just to stab you with his knife. God damn it. Quit rolling so high. Hey. 20. Alright. Seven damage. Oh, Slam it into you. It, so none of the family is caught up yet. I mean, I They're coming. You hear them coming behind him. It's only in 12 <laughs> seconds. <laughs> 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 you were in the common room. Okay. Let's see. What does this do? Just pull out all the spells. Let's do this. <laughs> Pretty much. Random page I've never read before. Uh, I mean, I only have one more spell slide, so I guess I have to go back up here now. Uh, what is this? Fat to attack the wizards, but it does say it attacks wizards on their own if there are any. Mm. Of course. Just saying. Um. Is he undead? He doesn't look it. He looks like just a crazy guy. Like a bad man. Really into stabbing you. Yeah. <laughs> really Wearing a MAGA hat. Um, right, maybe, maybe. I guess we'll go with Ray. I'll step, step back and cast Ray of Frost at him. Nice. You, you hit him squarely, and he kind of, uh, you see him chill. He kind of yells and pushes off. And he's slowed, but of course we're within close range of each other, so it really doesn't matter. At the same matter. time as you, yes, the, um, Luke sits up from the um, bench that he's been sleeping on. <laughs> oh. Jean glances at him, well, and dives at him with the knife. Oh, okay. <laughs> 
That well, he said he was mad at the beginning. I was confused who he was talking about. Apparently, he's talking about yeah, our Instagram followers. Kind of across the table. Why are you be rolling those against me? Yeah, <laughs> is Luke just standing there, looking shocked, and does not move out of the way? Hmm. What you gonna do? Uh, so he's now on the other guy, right? All right, Ray Frost again, ready to go. Woo. So, he isn't gonna hit him. That's okay. Two damage isn't much either, so. No, right. He has one more stab at Luke. And that's a hit. No. Start follower. So he slams the knife into him and pulls it down. And oh. Luke just looks surprised for a second and then just collapses to a seated position on the bench. Mm. At that mm. point, the door at the back of the bar opens, and the innkeeper with a large cudgel walks out. My tank is here. <laughs> right? What are you going to do? Uh, Turn back towards you. He's wandering back towards me? Turned back towards As soon as he killed Luke, he kind of turned towards you. No, he's just wandering. He's like, I don't know. Oh. This yeah. Yeah. Three yeah. more yeah. damage. <laughs> hey, Frost, hit him again. He's definitely taking damage right now. All right, let me add the... In the right. butt. <laughs> Booty hole. Yeah. Whose name I can't quite remember. Let's give him an initiative. Oh, so he's after Jean, I'm afraid. Oh my god. Some guy <laughs> across the table again. 14, 15, 16. Goes to hit you. 16. Okay. Yes. Karu, no. Yes. Desperately, desperately need mage armor. Well, I have a shield, but the shield only gives me plus five. So that would put me at 15, which is just one, you're one over, so there's no point in casting it until, I'm, gotcha. until I need it. Seven. He slams it into your gut and twists. All right. I any point, does one of us have a spidey sense that are... Uh, that are it will take closer. you about 35 minutes to get back, probably. I'll be long yeah. dead by then. You slam, you feel the cold of your blood draining out of your stomach wound as your knees buckle under you and you collapse to the a, ground. It's just a flesh wound. <laughs> <laughs> but a flesh wound. I, have, I remember long, long ago we were playing AD&D and one mm -hmm. of the guys was fighting. We were playing Athos, Dark Sun, which is a setting you'll never ever play because it's too <laughs> dangerous nowadays. And um... One of the people in the group was attacked by a lion, and back then lions <laughs> hit with a hit with a claw and then raked with their back legs, and it basically took him from like huge hit points to one, and that's exactly what he said. <laughs> Tis <Yeah>. a flesh wound. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm not dead yet. yet. And it was the first action of the combat. It was just like lion went bang, bang, rake, and he was just like. <laughs> so you're good at doing similar things and spilling on the ground. You right. uh, see the you see the innkeeper closing on uh, Jean just as you black out. All right. All right. Back at the plantation, seems all quiet here. Well, <laughs> yeah, all quiet. the back in. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. New follower. That's a bummer. We should really check on our friends. <laughs> no, we I have a sneaking suspicion. Oh, she's... <laughs> that is I'm meta gaming. If you want to make me stabilization checks, you can. What? Stabilization? How many do I have? Death saves. Death oh, save. How do I do that? Where... Oh, that's there is a death okay. save button. I found it. That's a fail. Oh, oh no! <laughs> okay. 
Do I keep going or you want me to? I, mean, I would just like to say that Bunny survived two years of games with me and how <laughs> you have almost murdered her in like three. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm also playing an extremely good year. Two years of games with you, Karoo, may not be so lucky. <laughs> and Robert Jackson was great. And it was. Okay, everybody um, at the plantation has a wonderful evening. Nothing terrible Woo happens. Smell the hand <laughs> here. The sun begins to rise. Okay, let's go back to the end. Oh, Take a nap. Waste of time. <laughs> Wait, should I should I roll until whether I actually die or? Wait. And see how you All do. right. Dead. Oh, no. <laughs> Dead. Oh, no, alive, 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 alive. Oh, good. This, this isn't necessarily how it's going to end, but you want to roll. One more. See if you survive. Keep going. <laughs> no, that's three fails, right? No, it's no, not. No, it's two fails, one success. <laughs> and below the fail, and eleven and up that survive. Oh, is it you happy? Yeah. Ten. Right now, so. You don't have to because that's not what. Hey! Hey! Right. Woo! Hey, the other one. Are you ready? All right. I'm gonna try it. Yeah. 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 I survived. We need help. We you, still have our eyes, bitch. You you come to, and the cleric shaman is over you. He's healed you a little. Um, that's like one hit point. <laughs> no, he's oh, he worships the god of one hit point. One hit point. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You're unconscious. He's like, stay still. Uh, I need to work on you some more. Night. <laughs> Says hope he doesn't know too many gymnasts. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's a terrible That's joke. Not, Keep going. Topical, not topical anymore, right? <laughs> I know. Okay. Um, you come conscious. You look across and see Jean dead in the middle of the room. Uh, the constable is here, Ooh. and so is the innkeeper. I mean, you did a fair bit of damage to him before you died. So <laughs> you <laughs> passed the fuck out. Yeah, he's died. Yeah, that's not terrible. That's pretty good. And they just finished the job for you. So, and they, uh, also the uh, constable came came too, and then the cleric arrived. So, had you held on, you'd have had a little bit of help. I did hang on. I didn't die. You didn't die, and he's very impressed by you not dying. Uh, <laughs> unfortunately, Luke is completely dead. His, yes. entrails. Oh, oh, no. His entrails are now extrails on the <laughs> <laughs> I'm never going to be Instagram famous I now. <laughs> no, he was just a follower. Oh, he, wasn't oh, great. Yeah, still. he wasn't creating his own amazing content. <laughs> Be sure. Thing says you've got to be sure to pack the wound with spiders. You don't want an infection. Ew. <laughs> Take the infection, thank you. That just sent, that sent like shivers up my back. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, well, I'm going to be infected. That's just how that's going to roll. Yeah, um, yeah, no thanks, but no thanks. <laughs> they still, they, they still Game for a second here. I just want to talk about my brother real quick. Because uh -huh. when I was a little little kid, he loved to tell me about how spiders would crawl into my ear <laughs> and uh, lay eggs in my brain, and then the eggs would hatch and the babies would eat my brain. And that gave me oh, a huge no. phobia. Oh, yeah, I can see that. <laughs> nice. yeah, he was I'm, a I'm spider fan. The point where if I see one like just crawling on the wall, I'll be like, oh, hey, a spider, I'm going to keep an eye on you, but you can do whatever you do. But if one gets on me, then I'm like, oh, God. Get out of my ear. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of my ear. You're terrible, spider. Terrible spider. <laughs> spider. Spider. They're so right. cool. Spider. You survived. Webs are neat. I survived. Mm. That was impressive surviving. You fought like a wizard should fight on the run. <laughs> Screaming for help. Screaming for help, yes. <laughs> oh. But I'm squishy. Glass cannon, glass cannon. <laughs> right. I mean, that was good though. You got some spells off at him, which was pretty nice. And I mean, his level is pretty good. You took him down to less than half hit points before I had to bring in someone to beat the rest of him out. And you lived, which is great. Nice. I mean, that was a risk. You could have actually died, I guess. I could have actually died, yes. 
would have been all like, well, we'd accomplish nothing. Oh, no. Well, I figured, you know, splitting up the party and then maybe keep at the end and keep the innkeeper and his wife safe probably would have been a good idea. But apparently the rest of my team's like, fuck that. He's only going to go back home tonight. That's it. <laughs> Tremendously into the plot. It was amazing. And it was perfectly timed, too. It was supposed to happen then. Oh, my God. Nice. Super impressed. Like a horror movie. Just like a horror movie, there's someone on their own, like, and there's the murderer. It's, one, it's one exactly like horror movies. Almost. So do I need to cast a healing spell on Miss... Uh, Are you guys back with me now, I guess? Oh, it's we... going gonna to be a while. By the time they get back, oh, well, the cleric will heal you fully. Although your clothes will never quite recover. <laughs> so I only I lose one hit point due to uh, sadness. Just pure uh, bad fashion. Yeah, it's just like torn everywhere. It's pretty bad. So um, you get back to the inn. Um, you find a scene of disarray in the morning. Um, Guys, I got a great it, story. It looks like she's been in a bit of a fight. Um, there are two bodies inside, and there is a cart outside ready to take them both away. One of them is Luke, and the other one is a man in a hooded cloak. What's that? So, um, you'll never believe it, but I killed one. <laughs> <laughs> one what? Good question. <laughs> Bad man? He's not really undead, but he's very crazed. That's for sure. Let's let's. This this is Jean Tarascon. He's supposed to be running that. Um, oh, that's who station. we were looking for. <laughs> what happened? What happened to our my Instagram follower? Yeah, he got in the way. Um, oh. <laughs> actually, it seemed almost like Jean wanted to kill Luke. Mm, yes. We, they called him Whelp and stuff, right? Yeah. As soon as he saw him, he immediately changed targets and pounced on him. Boo. Do we, can we tell that Jean is dead dead or not? I mean, I'm suspicious. Dead dead. Is he, is he dead? We can end double tap. Jack, just double tap. Put a little Stop. mirror under, put a little mirror, mirror under his ring, nose. Ring, ring. Stab him a few more. Anybody checking his Simple body? Huh? Yeah, I'd, I'd like to check Anyone his like check body, his but body. also his belongings. So I say, I mean, I'm wondering. The lawful good cleric is like, he may be up. Oh, he's definitely dead and has all these things. Yes. Is there anything I can take off of him as like a token? Things you can take off of him. Yeah, what's he got? With consent. No, he's dead. Up. There's no such thing as consent. Uh, the priest steps back and just bows his head as you start stripping him of all his belongings. <laughs> the, constable, the constable just walks out for a minute, and he's, he's yeah. You've done. You've done. You've taken a lot would, of hardship, and he's happy it's over. I would so like to take wanted, the hood. Okay. Oh, really? You want a creepy murderer? Of her? <laughs> I do. Because I want to be able to impersonate him and maybe try and find the rest of his cult that the villagers think I think you're a little exists. short for that. It's, it's actually a full cloak, like a huge billowing cloak with a huge hood. Can I Awesome. Take it? This is perfect for Alcanora. Yeah. He's going to be my... I'm, <laughs> I'm seven <laughs> feet tall. I think that... Yeah. Would... <laughs> no, we're gonna do the dread pirate Roberts. Like, I'm coming for your soul, and you'll like be in the oh, wall. Yeah, we'll soon not be here. Yeah. So, additionally to the cloak that is disappearing into the party, he's wearing still <laughs> leather armor underneath it. If you want that. Uh, uh, that's well, a can I actually wear that? If you, if you have um, light armor proficiency. Are you a sorcerer? I think you do have light armor proficiency now as a sorcerer, right? Uh, mm -hmm. I'd, have, I'd have to look it up. Yeah. Because so <laughs> it, it would increase my AC, so. It's a long side. Can you look at your 
Amy. Where? Scroll down. To the left. Woo! Proficiencies. List them automatically. I don't think so. I guess we can stop the creepy music now, right? I see language and what That's it. Maybe you are proficient. Proficient? You, you, you have languages? Yeah, uh, yeah, no, exactly. I don't think you're proficient in... I guess. So you can get a feat at level, like, four, which will allow you to get armor proficiency. But right okay. now, you're supposed to rely on the magics. Got it. Well, well like I said, I have shield. shield just, just you kept rolling freaking 19s. 19, so, so 10 plus 5, what doesn't, doesn't help me? me. <laughs> say, I'm, I'm happy to roll open. That's one of the problems with being a GM, right? I played enough roll master to roll open most of the time. Bits of the party dropping off left, right, and center. It's good. Gives you a chance. Okay. So uh, additionally on his body, he has an incredibly nice ring. Ooh. He's also nice. carrying, he's also, you also realize that in his hand, he has a, his dagger has a wooden handle. And in his other hand, he's holding a stick and they both go together. So it would look like a walking cane with a dagger inside. So he's Lucy as an boy. He's totally that. <laughs> with the whole like wand in his like walking. Uh -huh, except for he's got a terrible curved <laughs> dagger. His pockets of both the cloak and his, everything else are full of red licorice pieces. Red licorice, mm. yummy. Um, so, so what's the ring? ring? Can I tell what it is? Is it magical? Detect magic. Uh, I do not. Does anyone have detect magic? No. Wow. It's like the worst part. Of Apparently, <laughs> we need detect magic. So when we level, let me know, and I'll get that. Jesus. <laughs> I'm a rogue. I'm gonna take the ring regardless, and uh, I don't know what it does though. So I guess maybe I'll try to find the. Oh, there. Three's got detect magic. Yay! Oh, really? <laughs> Algonora to the rescue. Both the ring and the dagger are magic. How would we know what kind of are magic they, what they, it they, is exactly? You know what's sure, cool. Sure. Murderer's terrible dagger is good magical. Murderer's <laughs> terrible ring is so good magical. Can I do an arcana check to see you if it's the same? Yeah. Like a, the ID or is that kind oh, of work Jesus right? Christ, come on. We shouldn't touch that. <laughs> is that a six? Apparently my, my Maybe. The big contribution was deciding. Apparently I'm like half asleep still. So recovering. Yes, you know? sir. In the middle of the night. It's having a hard time. <laughs> You're shaking up. <laughs> I'm, I'm, a bit, I'm a bit shaken up. Karu has been all fails, and Fury has been almost all 20s I know. and 19s. <laughs> nice. That's crazy, right? uh, Fury, I'm going to need uh, you to touch me with your good luck charms, please. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so there, Arcana doesn't identify a magical items. You have to have a short rest Ew. to do so. Okay. But well, we should probably tell short rest cool. anyway, considering I have no spell slots anymore. Right, I'm assuming everyone's going to have a long rest right now because they're exhausted. We're tired. We never yeah. slept. You can also cast the Identify right. spell if you had it, or you could experiment by putting it on. No, I mean, she knows what's probably what, probably what I was just going to do. Is, so. Put it on. Um, Put it on. I'm just going to stick it on. I'm so yeah. it anyway. Yes. Just stick it on. You would also just know what school yes. it is, though. Well, in case it's true. like necromancy or something. Like, yeah. what school is it from? Not necromancy. Not okay. necromancy. It's That's good. Okay. Um, I'm gonna keep it, but not quite put it on yet. How's that? Oh wait, <laughs> I'm, I'm scared. scared. Now I'm scared. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you put it on. I'm putting Tama. it in my pocket. <laughs> in your pocket. It's in my pocket. Magical ring. Put it invisible. in my pocket. Is you invisible? Oh, so I'm oh. just Frodo now. Got it. Make the other hand's given a high oh, five. Two items for the metal of the dagger and the ring. Anyone yeah, who okay. spends time resting, a short rest, which is 15 minutes, holding I'm... any item concentrating on it, Damn. will 
you to identify it. I will do that when we long rest. And really, I like to steal from you the ridge. You're resting now because no one has slept and you were seriously attacked. Yeah, we all need to. I just don't know if we want to finish talking to these people about the thing yeah. first. Look, before we you uh, need to rest. Uh, we, can, we can take care of the bodies. Now you've had chance to investigate them. <laughs> Look down, the okay, strip them. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Pat, so I pat Lucas is. on the head, and I'm like, "You were a good follower." And then I, I go into the rest of the room. It's called Luke, not Lucas, but that's okay. Yeah, that's exactly my level of how entwined <laughs> I How much you cared about him. Yeah. He's good Lucas. The heartbreaking death if he dies. He doesn't have to die, you know. He's dead. But he didn't That's... have to. You could have took him with you. You could have looked after him. But no, you're just like, we've got a follower. Let's leave him wherever he... Oh, he's been murdered by his crazy <laughs> maniac brother. Oh, he won't wow. talk to us. He follows I mean, I accidentally, like. I didn't know he was in the common room just sleeping, so I accidentally let him do it. Nobody ever, nobody ever asks, but he's been sleeping in the common room since you arrived in town. Because <laughs> <laughs> no one bought him a bed. Hell no. Because <laughs> you're all garbage. Our people. one follower can't even. <laughs> That's pretty terrible. He needs to pull himself up by his own bootstraps. Is that right? Bootstraps. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, now he can't. Now his bootstraps and pulling himself up are not going to happen. So they take the bodies away, and you are free to rest if you wish. Yeah, cool. Okay. Let's all actually oh, rest, always, rest as well, always. too. Do you identify 10 the items 30. before you rest? Mm. Well, I do want to identify, yes, yeah, please. Okay. So the ring is a ring of protection, which you desperately Ooh. need. Yes! <laughs> Protection requires attunement, and it will give you a plus one armor class and a plus one to saving throws while wearing it. Hey. The dagger for anyone attuning it. Anyone? You, does anyone use a dagger? Uh, I use I daggers. Use a dagger, but you could use a dagger better than I could. Use Probably. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty How good long does it take me to attune to it? 15 uh, minutes. It's pretty oh, short. Oh, okay. But so basically, I there's a limit on the now. number of items you can wear at the same time. Yeah, I mean that's fair, but this is the only one I have, so we're good right now. So, so I, I get, get a plus one to my armor class, and a plus one to all saving throws, and a plus one to all saving. Where would I add that? So that's I don't know where that would be on the sheet. We'll have to look. Yeah. Okay. Where you'd add it on the sheet, but basically everything. That would be a, an attribute save goes up by one. I don't know and a clasp. Is. Oh, sorry. Okay. The dagger is a plus one dagger inside yeah. a inside a walking cane. Yeah, inside of a walking like, cane. Yeah, yeah. The cane is kind of curved, and the blade is curved inside it. It's like a big, like wow. stabby assassin dagger. That's cool. <laughs> That's cool. I'm gonna go around walking like on, on, on a cane and then and then just stab him. That's great. Yeah. Good. It's a good one. That's great. Okay, you said you want to call it here because you're tired and you want to go to bed and have a job? I am late. Well, I don't have a job, but I would like to just go to bed for funsies. Oh, are you still, <laughs> <for funsies? laughs> are you still <laughs> suckling at the bosom of the state? I am. <laughs> <laughs> And, and 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 Thomas. The bosom of Thomas. <laughs> At least two, right? I switch one to two, one to two. Right. <laughs> All right. Uh, I think it's time we gave you experience, I guess, right? Yay! Out his experience because I made him up on the fly and I know what level he is. So I'm to figure out what big. I have no books with me because the internet. Damn you, internet. All right. That's not what I want. How much XP do I level? I want to know how much a creature at this level is. I think she was going to die. I, I, I thought. I hopes. Hopes. 
That was good, though. You get good running and casting spells. Be a powerful wizard one day, and they'll just freeze them real, real quick. Sweet. Oh, chat thinks you now have a pimp cane. <laughs> That's fine. I just love that the cane's probably as big as I am. <laughs> well, it's like a human sized cane, but yeah. I mean, it's probably like a staff I'm to you. I'm three right? and a half feet tall. <laughs> like a staff to you, then, right? It's like a yeah. knife in the top. Like a big knife. A really big knife. No Size restrictions on weapons anymore, right? It no, so it's great. Uh, <laughs> it does not matter anymore. Let me see. Graphical creature. Maybe. Uh, Black pudding. A banshee. That'll do. D. Why do I never find the end, even though I've typed it five thousand times? Oh. He's worth a bunch of XP, by the way. Woohoo! He's worth Go a bunch Karu. of XP. Go, Caro. Way to take the whole party with you. <laughs> right. Everybody gets exp you get experience for sitting on top of that um, yeah. building. For murdering, surviving a murder attempt by Jean Tarastan, you get 1,100 experience. Holy cow. Shit. But then divided by, by six. six. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> I'm just going to throw out, if this was a civil game like Rollmaster, you'd have had all that experience to yourself. Hey, and I'd be like, what, what level, level four, four and everybody else would be level two? two? Yeah, well, in Rollmaster, you level differently. So at one point, oh, I was okay. level 10, and the rest of the party was level six, four. Oh, my God. I'll just, yeah, it's it's an interesting game. So it was how much again? Sorry. You should be up to 649. All right, thank you for doing the math. <laughs> Yeah, I got it, guys. We should be up to 649 experience points right now. Nice work, people. Right. When, what is level three? I don't know. I don't know. Is it a thousand? I would like it to be. I think it's three. We, would have a, we did have a long rest, right? I yes. didn't sleep too much. Yes, you leveled. Uh, you leveled. You're long rested. I don't know whether you leveled. Everybody it's 900. 900, yes. I think it's close. That's not terrible. 900, you're pretty close. You're edging that way. No, I think we could maybe hit it next time if we murder it's designed, stuff. It's designed for, what is it, two to three, two to three sessions generally per level. -ish. Okay. Depending on what you do. I mean, some sessions are more discursive. Some sessions are more experience and combat heavy. Some are more story heavy, but generally... Some of have like random some... encounters from thing in it. <laughs> Maybe we could get two levels. I mean, the, the risk there is that I can roll a random encounter, but it might be like two guys in a boat. Mm. <laughs> I mean, there, there are like normal, there are normal encounters on those things. How much experience you get for killing a boat? <laughs> it depends. It depends whether or not it's a dire boat. <laughs> no, it depends or not if if it's a motorboat. <laughs> <laughs> All right, kids. Thank you all for listening. <laughs> visit us on the website, visit us on the Twitters and the Facebooks. Come see us on Discord, please. Hey. Help us with that emoji <laughs> game that we just can't finish. Yeah, <laughs> no. Failing. We've only got like two or three movies left to identify and it's driving us all crazy. Yeah, I, I added what I knew. That wasn't it's good. Idea. We're getting there. We're so close. The worst part is Fohammer has the has the actual chi 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 to know he's grading us, which is even. Oh no! <laughs> so Thank yes, you. come help us. Please visit on Discord. Say hi. Visit the website and listen to the three thousand of the recordings that we have <laughs> and all of that noise. And thank you so much. And we will see you later. Yes. Thank you. Bye. 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 <laughs>